Okay, I'm in the lobby of the Merlot. All right, Aiden. Let's do it. I'm hacking in. Look at that. Secrets and lies floating in a cloud of data. I just reach out, pluck it from the sky, and it's mine. It's ours. Stay focused. We got a nasty security system. How much we got? A hundred grand in 30 seconds. God bless the rich and famous. We are the modern day magicians. Siphoning bank accounts out of thin air. Do you hear yourself? <laughs> what was that? Hello. I think someone else is hacking in. Let's take a peek. Let's not. Stick to the plan, Damien. Siphon the accounts and get out. Adventure, my boy. Have faith in your mentor. Something triggered that alarm. Let's find it. Shit. It's scanning the system. I'm almost there. I'm shutting down now. Don't you touch a thing. What the hell is that? We need to abort. We are not done. Help me. Damien, it's over. I'm disconnecting. Maurice. Yeah? You're on. One of our contractors ran a search for the hackers in the Merlot job. You're assigned Aiden Pierce. Take him out. Hit the family if you need to. This guy's hacking days are done. Hit the family? Not a problem? Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. Who gave the order? Come on, I told you. I don't know. You don't know. Hit the family? Not a problem. Nope. I'll scare him good. You'll never hear from him again. So what do you think, Maurice? Did you scare me? It was a job, man. I didn't know. Who was on the other end of the call? Give me a name. They never gave me a name! Yeah, and I'll tell you a name. Oh. Lena. Lena Pierce. I didn't know about any kids, all right? That wasn't supposed to happen. I want you to think very carefully. Think. Look, man. Even if I knew a name, you couldn't get me talking. These guys... I heard stories, man, they're like nothing you ever seen before. You gotta walk away from this, man. Some things you can't walk Please. away from. Please! Who gave the order? I spoke to them on the phone and they told me where to find you. That's all I know, man. That's all I know. Give me a name. I don't know! Ah! How's your memory now? Ah.
Maurice won't talk to me, but I bet he talked to you. I can't keep running. I can't do it. I need to keep moving. Yo, Maurice! Yo, what's shaking, motherfucker? Where the hell you been? What? He's talking to me. I leave you for two minutes. Give me my bullets. I tossed them. But you said you'd kill them otherwise. I told you to hold on to them, Jordy. Where you been anyway? I had to make a call. And you get what you need from Maurice? Oh, you're kidding me. Let's clean this mess up. Stop admiring your work. Hey, that's cute and all, but I'm disappointed, Pierce. I mean, you failed to spot the nasty inter-gang drama I'm creating here. I don't like loose ends. Let's get him out of here. No, too late. Bottom of the eighth. Chicago's ahead. Game's almost over. We are out of time. <laughs> huh. Nice shot. Huh. Come on, you're not just a little interested in my phone call. All right, fine. Tell me about your phone call. Glad you asked. Okay, we got a bunch of dead bodies, right? We got 40,000 people above us. We need a distraction. I called the cops. You did? Oh, yeah, true story. So, cops arrive, and Maurice's little band of brothers arrive, and pow, 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 pow. Jordy, tell me you're joking. No, no, I called them too. Look, we get a messy altercation at the end of the game. You and I slip away undetected. You'll appreciate the plan tomorrow. Great, punctual cops. I handle these guys. You grab Maurice, get him out of here. Maurice? What do I look like, a chauffeur? He's the shooter. I'm not through with him yet. Hey. Ugh. Dick. Chicago police! If there's anybody in here, identify yourselves. Got a body here. Definitely a viceroy. Here's the weapon, gunshot wounds. I got another corpse, another viceroy. <laughs> Victimless crime, man. Why'd they have to pick the biggest game of the season to pull this shit? <laughs> <laughs> Roger the polls now by Jorge Sanova, who ended with an outstanding 15-7 record last season. We're watching an epic confrontation between two old rivals here today, and this game couldn't be any closer. Big base steals on this team with 27 steals this season. Looks like it unlocks from the other side. Like that's a pitch and a hit, and it looks like... Yeah, that's a foul ball. Roger's not calling for that one. Both men, of course, experts at the mind game. Two on, two out, folks. Something's gonna give soon, and it could go right either here. way. Sonoma Pitch got a known vice boy in the VIP lounge. We're gonna check him out. Okay, I'm coming up. He's not moving unless I give him a reason. Yeah, you, Bullshit, come here. man. You ain't got no probable cause. We're just talking. Look, I got my tickets right nope. here. No, yeah. keep your hands where I can hey, see them. this is bullshit. Jay didn't do nothing wrong. Get back now. Bad boy. The police are about to lock this whole place down. I'm stuck unless we create a major distraction. I want to cut the power and slip past them. To the whole stadium? I thought you wanted to keep the vigilante out of the news. 
Everything's connected to the CTOS with a serious firewall. Right now, I need to get out of the stadium. Can you find me the nearest access point? In the next room. Well, you'll need to find someone with security clearance. Security guard should have access. With all hey, these cops, there's gotta be one around. Yeah, I am. You got an evacuation plan, right? Of course we do. Good, we need to get moving on it. We're not gonna evacuate 40,000 people so we can play cowboys no, and Indians. Really. But you got an isolated incident. Where are you, Jordy? What? Gone. I'm allergic to cops, so is my race. But don't worry, I left you a present. Friend of a friend deals in pre-owned cars. Got a real beauty waiting for you in the garage across the street. Take it or leave it, nice. I don't care. Just saw a bunch of cops fly by go. out there. That's a lot of sirens for a blackout. Shit, something ain't Nobody right. Nobody checking this. All units, suspect is still in the vicinity. Let's find them. Trigger man. Just need to break through. Now. Push more, he's hard. Torture's not gonna work on this guy, so I need to get inside his head. The guilt is eating him up. I'll give him a couple of days. I bet I'll start reaching out. I did invite him. It's been so long. Are you sure you called the right number? Honey, your uncle's a different kind of person. It doesn't mean he doesn't love us. Maurice was correct. We've got 
gained access to the CTUS back door while the police were being distracted by you. Since we both win in this, we'll share what we have. That back door allows you some access to the CTUS network. I'm still working on something bigger. Give me time. pressing the window when she knows I was coming over. Or that little wobbly dance she did. It's always the same nightmare. City's full of distractions. And they can't hide from me.
That guy's out of control. I'm not gonna let him hurt anyone today. Simple trace of his call and he's mine. somewhere. Just move carefully. Don't get spotted. Let the profiler do the work. Right. Right. Okay. She must be the woman he's after. This guy's close. I can feel it. Hey! We need to talk. There's nothing to talk about. We're done. Deal with You're it. You're so fucking wrong. I'm not done yet. Get I gotta away. stop him now. I'll scream! Oh, get lost. You won't bother anyone now. What the hell? Jesus, no. Nikki, hey, I know, I know, the party started. It's almost over. Where are you? I'm on my way. Ugh, you make me crazy. Jackson's really looking forward to it. Get over here. We miss you. I miss you too. I'll be there. Sorry, Nick, I need to take this. I'll, I'll see you soon. Good. You got out. Look, if you need some wheels, give me a call. I'll, I'll set you up. Pre-owned cars? You'd rather register yourself at a car dealer? I don't ask questions. This guy gets me any ride I want. And you, if you need it. I just might. How's Maurice doing? Oh, he's all sunshine and buttercups. I'm gonna dump him at my little dumping place. I need him alive, Jordy. Yeah, yeah, alive. Whatever. Goes against your better nature, huh? I'd pop him and be done, but hey, you pay me right, I'll keep him alive as long as you want. I do work for a paycheck. members of the Chicago South Club were arrested following the police raid of a popular
Jack's last birthday, Lena sang off key. Happy birthday. Full throttle, no holes barred. Now, I'm afraid of the silence. What's your problem? Okay, so she's gonna be Yeah, but Okay. How old are you today? Ten. No, I think you're nine. I'm ten. Nine. Ten. Nine. <laughs> ten. Well. In that case, uh, you deserve 10 birthday tickles. What? One, two, three, four, Stop. five, six, Stop. seven, Stop. eight, Stop. nine, ten. <laughs> ten. 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 Stay here for a second. So, an entire year and... and yeah, late. Yeah, I'm sorry, Nick. Really. Come here. Let's have a look at you. You look older. Oh, nice. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> it's his first birthday without Lena. Uh, how's he doing? Still doesn't talk to anybody but me. Yolanda says it's his way of maintaining some sort of control. Yolanda? His therapist. She's helping him. It's good. Just slow. It's hard, but we're gonna get through it. Mm -hmm. Jax. Hey. S sorry I'm late. Can I, uh, do I get a hug? Wow. You are big. <laughs> So, hey, what, what do you got there? Wow, the healer. Cool. You bought him a real toy, huh? Hmm. Why don't you bring up your toys? I'm going to speak with your uncle. Yeah, I'll be, I'll be up there in a sec. This matters. You being here. I just need to make sure that things are different. Things are different. You and Jax are the most important people in my life. I'm not going to stop watching out for you. <laughs> Always the big brother, huh? Last time I was back here, it was Lena's birthday. Jackson adored her. We all did. You missed all the fun. The kids were playing vigilante, imitating that guy they keep talking about on TV. Let me guess. Jax was the vigilante. No, they were all the vigilantes, and I was the only villain, but I make a mean bad guy. <laughs> I gave him hell. I should have come earlier. I could have warned them. Don't mess with my sister. Remember when you and mom were both sick as dogs, but dad insisted his boy was gonna have his birthday cake? That thing was an abomination. All burnt and lopsided. That was dad in a nutshell. He did a lot of ugly things, but it was always about family. Listen to me, I'm rambling. Oh, really? <laughs> no, 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 don't. Listen, the police can trace this call. Oh. I know where you live. How are the locks on those doors? Who is this? Why are you calling? Do you feel safe, Nikki?
Who was that? Doesn't matter, just some stupid crank, it happens. Do you think this is strong enough? Look, did you know his voice? Oh, Jesus, Aiden, just leave it, it's fine. It's fine, he thinks he can get inside. How do you know what he thinks? You're checking the locks. Look, I can handle this on my own, we do not need your help. Nikki, I can find this guy. Okay, look, Aiden, God, you have not changed at all. We do not need your help. Please stop trying to fix our problems. Every time you try, you just make things worse. I better go. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. That's right. Grown man making crank calls. Let's see how safe you feel when I trace your call. There you are. Damn it. He's on the move. I've been afraid of this. Threats to my family. Again. Sorry, I overreacted. You just make me so crazy sometimes. Uh-huh. Come on back, okay? I promise I won't freak out on you. Uh... Aiden? You're going after that creep, aren't you? Well... You're doing it right now. I can't believe you. It's not like that. Stop being a hero, Aiden. Let it go. Let what? Yeah, the call's breaking up. I can't hear you. No, you can hear me perfectly. You need to stop right now. Yeah. Hello? You still there? Can't hear you. Okay, gotta go. Oh! Hey, all right, never mind. Hey, watch it. just to make a crank call. Nikki Pierce, right? I'll mention the locks like you said. And her kid. I, I, this feels wrong. That's the point. Someone paid this asshole to harass Nikki. Who would pay for something like that? What the hell? Did you get anywhere with DedSec? Any of those CTOS hacks? Yeah, I'm still trying. They're kicking you out. Give me time. Okay. Well, I need your help then. Can you trace a phone call? How can I refuse my best client? Wait. What am I looking at here? It's from a guy who threatened my family. I want to know who hired him. Well, the call came from somewhere in the Loop District. But that's as far as I can see. Okay. If I can hack CTOS inside the Loop. Then I should be able to pinpoint the source of that call. Let's do that. Bloom's building a new CTOS center in the loop. It's perfect. DedSec tried to attack that center last month. We failed, and they just added more armed guards. So it won't be easy. Be careful. You sound like my sister. Relax. Make sure I'm armed and dangerous.
Bloom hires private contractors to guard their CTOS centers. These guys will be geared up and wired for action. But I'll be ready. If CTOS doubles their guards, I better double my weapons. Welcome. Over the past few weeks, CTOS centers throughout Chicago have increased security due to several attacks from activist hacker group DeadSec. See? When asked about security changes, Bloom spokeswoman Charlotte Gardner was decisive. Chicago's safety is paramount, so we've hired private security for every CTOS control center. These highly skilled peacekeepers have trained in the most dangerous regions of the world. In fact, Ms. Gardner, these peacekeepers you refer to are military mercenaries, many with criminal records. Isn't that true? Indeed. Military, but we should hardly reject our brave soldiers for proudly serving their country, should we? Our CTOS network is what she'll say without the peace. This new security is no joke. I need access. How to find out who's targeting my family. I want that voice behind the phone call. Remember your training.
TOS? Already? I'm looking at the network as we speak. You've got your access, and I've got mine. Profiler systems online. Everybody's nasty little secrets at the click of a button. This thing's highlighting all kinds of stuff in the district. I could take advantage of some of this. Keep an eye out for online traffic. Could be fixers in the network. If I can see them, they can see me. All right, I gotta move. I mean, a lot of noise here. Give me time to track your caller. I'll be in touch. said I'd handle it. What's the job? Exactly. It's a delivery job. Gotta move some guy. I mean, how hard is that? Just keep in mind my reputation's on the line here. He's paying top dollar for the best driver in Chicago. Then he's in luck. What the hell, a fixer? 
I made too much noise in the loop. This guy's found me. Well, now I better find him. Jordy's job will have to wait. If I trace his signal back, I'll find him before he breaches my phone. the search area. Come on, Aiden. Find him quick. That ain't polite. <coughs> Where are you? Shit, I gotta find this guy. He's almost in. There you are. You're mine now. Got him. That's one fixer down. How many more are out there? Well, someone's taken an interest in me. Fixers are mercenaries, they work for a paycheck. Someone's issued a contract on me. That's bad fucking news. I remember right. These guys communicate through the grid. Grid connections down. I'd love to take on one of these guys. I'll have to wait. All right, now I can deal with Jordy's job. Some kind of driving contract, delivering a guy somewhere. 
This won't. Be a typical taxi service. The trick with these jobs is avoiding the cops. Hope you have an invitation or you're dead. I'm the driver. Fuck, man, what took you so long? You got a car, this thing's shot to hell. Nope. My rule's your car. That's the job. All right, well, come on, man, let's go.
nothing worth the shit. Eddie's dead. I left him back there. Oh man, the cops came out of nowhere. This is bad. Just follow the route and keep an eye out. The cops are still searching. Your route's gonna get us killed. Sit back and keep quiet. Damn, it's a patrol car! I see it. They said you were good. You did it! Okay, we're here. We did it. There's some guys meeting us. Don't fuck it up now. What the fuck? That's Lucky Quinn. Why is the club boss meeting us? He's not meeting us. He's meeting you. Someone knew. I swear, I don't know what happened. There wasn't supposed to be anybody. I, I mean, it's a computer plant, right? I turn around, the alarm's going off. The cops got there so fast. <laughs> I didn't... Quiet now. It's all over, son. I got it, at least, right? That's what matters. It is indeed what matters most. Here's how the world turns. Not much room for fuck-ups. Oh, oh, I get that, Mr. Quinn. I do. It wasn't my fuck-up, though. Yeah, it wasn't. Yeah, well, calm I... now. It's all right. Calm? Get a chance to talk to your mama? Call your friends? Your girl? No, sir. I was in a hurry. That's good. Very good. <laughs> Mr. Quimper! Oh! Uh, 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 uh. Tell your employer I'll call again. If ever I need a, another delivery. Lucky fucking Quinn. He runs the Chicago South Club. These assholes have been preying on Chicago since before I was born. I could have done the city a huge favor if I put one between his eyes. But this is exactly what I've been trying to stay away from. It always comes back hard. That can't happen again. Hey, how'd it go? You finished that job yet? You thought I'd be okay working for the fucking club? A paycheck is a paycheck. You gotta start separating the morals from the moolah. Relax. Listen, I can hook you up with my guy. He'll find you better driving gigs if you want. Yeah, sure. I don't know if I'll take them. Give him my name. Who says no to extra cash, right? Oh, and since you asked, Maurice is doing just fine in his new home.
I've got some thing for you. We need to meet. Meet? What, face to face? Should I look for a guy in a mask? No mask. Just follow my signal. I thought you never wanted to meet. I don't. But we need to meet. TOS network system effectively turning out the lights. Eleven people died because of that. I've hired Bad Boy before, and he's always protected his identity. That's how DeadSec works. Now he wants to meet. That's unusual. All right, I'm gonna try and shake him off his game. Let's see what he's up to. Bad boy. What? Bad boy, 17. What the fuck, man? Bad boy 17? Clara. Clara. You don't look 17. <sighs> Do I look like a bad boy? No, you look like a wild card. I hope I don't frighten you. What, do you have a reason to frighten me? Now you're being paranoid. Am I? Someone is fucking with my life. Threatening my family, and at the same moment, the mysterious bad boy wants to meet me, and he is a she? He is a lie? Listen. I need to trust you, Clara. I wouldn't trust me if I were you. But here's a reason to listen. The text message you sent me? I know where to find him. Yeah. Well, we don't need to meet face to face for that. No. We needed a face-to-face -face for this. You wanted that sex system Max? You got me in. You should be nicer to me. I'm about to open your world. Yeah. Well, you're not the first woman to promise me that. Mm-mm. Mm they do all their nasty work through this. And they don't know I have access. No, you stole it. <laughs> this is powerful. Just don't be stupid. You screw around and you get people hurt. Worst. Hmm. Well, I don't think you trust me. Give me a reason to trust you. All right. The guy sent the text. How do we find him? We work together. You with everything I just said. Me. Tracking his signal. You're not quite what I expected. And you're exactly as I expected, Aiden.
Who? Am I talking to Bad Boy or Clara? Let's make it easy. Voila. So we need to track your caller. But he's sneaky. He's bounced his address through a CTOS office tower. Client services, employees, and executives. Things like that. An office tower? We need to find a way into the system. You get me in, I get you his location. I can get into the building where they're most vulnerable. Check out where they take deliveries. Looks like underground. In the tunnel. I'll start there. Hey, I'm sorry I was rough before. I know what you were doing. Trying to intimidate me. Very textbook. Stepping into my personal space, the stair, physical contact. You're trying to look for cracks. So did you find any? When you love to know. Hang on, I thought I heard something. See what's ahead? The layout shows a wide open indoor plaza. More guards, no doubt. Oh, those hacks I uploaded to your phone? It's perfect distraction. You can disrupt the equipment of any guard in there. Equipment like what? Anything. Hack their phones, earpieces, explosives. Everything runs off computer chips these days. Okay, I'll try it. You scan me the offices? Find me someone with an unsecured laptop. Got one. Bradley Coughlin. Oh no, <laughs> he's a security director. Of course he is. Once I hack in, you move fast. Track our caller and get out. It won't take long for security to spot the intrusion. Don't worry about me.
I'm telling you, it's not just an ad. It blocks my entire view. Just one enormous fucking... Oh, shit. Someone's hacked in. Oh, fuck me. Lock down the building. Find him now. It isn't over yet. Okay, I got you in. Can you track the caller? I'm searching now. Carlis. The police are coming. They've got Hydex cans that are hard to shake. You need to get out of there. The cops are scanning me. I can't get clear fast enough. Does DedSec know a way to jam their scans? Wait. I think we do. Here it is. I'm sending it to you. Can you find my collar? Tired of this cat and mouse. I got your mouse. This call was made from an apartment in the loop. Finally. Just be careful, Aiden. The way he bounced the signal around, I think he wants you to find him. Well, I certainly don't want to disappoint him. to meet. He knew exactly how to get my attention. Fine, I'll take the bait. are split. There must be two CTOS boxes.
this? Bellwether. I knew you'd find me. You always were one for a mystery. How are you, Aiden? Damien Brinks. The hell is he doing? I hope you don't mind the games. Wanted to see if you'd lost your edge. We need to talk. And, uh, you'll want to be quick. Breaking in like you did tripped an alarm. This isn't what I had planned for us. But we're about to be interrupted. Come find me. I'll pick someplace nice. Why would he harass my sister? We haven't spoken since... The Merlot. Looks like there's a new target for all you hitters out there. Drop what you're doing and get on it. You can't be far.
Aren't you a clever boy? Drinks on me. Damien. <clears throat> Tell me you miss me. You had that punk call my sister. Why am I here, Damien? You're always so grim, Hayden. My God. Don't you ever loosen up? I want my partner back. Me at the computer, you in the field doing the manly work. I'm here to help you. We both want the same things. Answers? Who attacked us? And I happen to know that you've hit a wall. Yeah, I figured. So, I come bearing glad tidings. The Merlot. The Merlot? Mm-hmm. The Merlot was your fuck-up. Bullshit. You bailed on a perfectly good scheme. No one would have found out if you had just stood by me. A six-year-old girl. My niece died because you went too far. Oh, you're adorable. Blaming your family problems on me? Damien crossed the line, he made the Batman angry. What about me? What about you? You're not the only one suffering! They made me a cripple! They took everything from me! Don't you see? That's what binds us together. You got nothing I need. There was another hacker. There was a second hacker. And I know how to find him. And that may be, Damien. But you can't do it on your own. You need me. Your big problem is... I don't need you. Don't walk away. This is the lead. Thanks for the tip. I used to look up to Damien. Taught me how to ferret out weak code and exploit it. But I taught him how to do the same without a computer. People can be more vulnerable than their systems. We were a strong team. After Lena, I was done with him. I didn't waste time thinking about him. But now he's creeping back in. I need to know what he's got on the Merlot. You know who keeps leaving the flowers? No. But that girl has a lot of friends. Had. This is about letting go. I know. We've all suffered a horrible nightmare, but... You have to stop trying to fix it. I'm not trying to fix anything. Aiden. I know what you're doing. I know you're chasing after the people that did this. When you do that, you put us all in danger again. You are not in danger. Because I protect you. Do you hear yourself? Aiden, why can't you stop? Because... I need to know. You are my brother, and I love you. 
But Jackson is my world, and I will keep you away in a second before I let him get hurt. Promise me you will stop. You can't save Lena. I killed her. No, you didn't. I don't blame you. But promise me you will stop. We need this. As a family. I promise. Maybe she's right. Lena's dead, I can't change that. How do I just walk away? Not a problem. Survivor from the stadium. If that guy talks, he'll ID you. Survivor? How did that happen? I'm guessing he didn't die. Now, relax. I got a plan. Meet me at Gorman Heights on the rooftop. Where is he? Majority can be a pain to work with. He's the devil I know. Things were different. I might be hunting him down. Or vice versa. But if he says we got a problem, I need to take it as a massive understatement. Can't let the survivor ID me. Everything's gonna spiral out of control. Hi. Oh, fuck. Jordy, who are they? Well, they live here. What happened? Well, security in these buildings is pretty tight. So people like this feel nice and secure living way up here. I mean, these people just had a, a simple chain lock on their door. I guess they want to have a good look at the pizza guy before they open it all the way. All right, fine, sure. So about this problem. Well, that's why I brought the bolt cutters. He opens the door this much, there's a chain right there, I slip him in and snip, and guess what? It's not the pizza guy. Jordy, the problem, let's deal with it. We are dealing with it. We're in the midst of solutions here, Pierce. You don't appreciate what I do for you. You don't realize how much I take care of you, do you? Really? Yeah. Well, do me a favor, let's get on with it. How much time do we have? Not as much as we need. Oh, you remember the stiff from the stadium? He's not so stiff anymore. The uh, cops got him in Chicago lockup, and oh, he's about to walk into an interrogation and point a finger right at you. How did that happen? Kick me when I'm down. Look at the view. See there? Call went out this morning. Somebody's paying Buku bucks to grab this clown and make him talk, and one of those guys is running the assignment. Well, it seems like me and him need to have a little chat. Yeah, but this time, don't do that empty gun thing. Poor Maurice pissed himself after your last show. Don't worry about my methods. You know how to use that thing? Just get your ass down there, I got you covered. And don't kill the boss this time. You kinda need him. You think? Let's make this quick, okay? My balcony hosts are moaning, and that stuff gives me migraines. I get a migraine, Pierce. I am useless to you. You think you're the only one who wants this quick? How should I know what you want? Not big on empathy, are you? Not particularly. What's up with this fixer contract? What are they looking for? You. Somebody
everybody wants the vigilante big time. They're about to fake a prisoner transfer to bust out the one witness who can ID you. I've never seen them gather up this kind of manpower, though. You know, I'll try and stop them. Listen, the witness knows my face. If the fixers reach him, if my name gets out there, they'll come after my family. Ah, the F word. You're too sentimental, Pierce. That's a weakness. Somebody's gonna play that against you someday. I'll cover you where I can, but I can't see everybody. All right, let's do this. Stay alert, just in case. Keep an eye out. Yeah, that's not normal. There'll be someone out there. I'm armed. Everyone get back. What the hell just happened? Search over there. Be careful. I got nothing. I'll check over there. Looking clear, I'll head that way. is inside that office. Douglas! What? That was his name, Douglas. Ah, oh, shit. Too late. You shot him. I couldn't remember his name. That sucks. I liked that guy. 
Had a lot of rabbi jokes. Fuck me if I can remember a single one of them. Do you think you could enjoy yourself a little less? Choose a job you love, and you never have to work a day in your life. Hold on. Hold on. Stop. Who's assigned to the prison job? What? Man, I don't know what you're talking about. Lance Brenner. As a family. What are you doing? I'm asking you how your family is. Looks like you got two lives going at once. Family man. And yeah, the kids are gonna be in college soon. It's pricey for a union rep. Fuck you. Yeah, and there's also the second life. Ghost accounts with a lot of money in them. Hey. Do you know that your name is tied to a whole bunch of cold cases? I bet the cops would love a chat. Okay, hold on. You want a piece of the cash? I can cut you in. You're wasting my time. All right, all right! Fuck. Prison job. It's Angelo Tucci. He's running a convoy. It's too late. You'll never find him. He says I want him. I bet he's got a family in town. Why do you want his family? The fuck is wrong with you? I wouldn't know where to begin. More fixtures incoming. How bad? Remember Kinderhook? Shit, oh. I got him.
Anyone got visual? Shit, I just... Shit! Searching. Never called me back. Did you find the guy we traced? Yeah. Some bad history there. Listen, I need to find someone else. This time I have a name, Helena Tucci. She's related to a guy I'm after. Does she live in Chicago? Yeah, I need a location right now. Got her. Wow, she's got a serious digital footprint. Okay, this morning she posted about a meeting today outside the Willis Tower. All right, I'll call you when I'm there. May need more help. Okay, I'm at the Willis Tower. What do you got on Helena? Looking through status updates. She likes selfies. Here she is making a duck face, a spiral face. She loves her cats too. Why are you targeting this clueless girl? I'm not. I need to find her uncle fast, and Helena's gonna point the way. The environment wants you to read this. Help save our planet. Practical everyday tips. Come on, yeah. Okay, here's something. She posted a pic this morning. Her outfit for the day. Dark hair and glasses. And she's showing off a green backpack. Thank you, social media. That's a start. I'll keep digging. Oh, poor girl. What's that? I've got her medical records. She had an abortion last year. That might explain the therapist she's seeing. Why are we prying this deep? I don't need a history, Clara. I need a location. Hey, I start the search and information just comes in. I don't control the content. Hold on. Perfect. She just posted a status update. She's inside Connolly Square. It's a glass structure. Should be right near you. I got it. Nice work, Clara. Now delete those files. I'm dead sick, Aiden. We believe information should be free. Clara. Relax. We don't pick on innocent girls. Hey, wait. Sorry, you're breaking so, up. 
Apparently someone no, invented a that pill. one for yeah, your password. Bad. Have you heard of this? This is crazy. You swallow this chip and it authenticates whoever you are for whatever account needs your phone. Okay, Elena. You're up. Hello? Miss Tucci? I'm Dr. Hyatt with the Chicago General Hospital. We received your Uncle Angelo's blood work, but you're the only number he gave us. Do you know where we can reach him? It's urgent. No, sorry. I haven't heard from my uncle in years. Okay, thank you, ma'am. Wait for it. Yeah. Hey, Uncle Angie. Elena! You need concert tickets again? No, listen, I got a weird call. I think the cops are looking for you. What? Damn it, you calling me just gave them a trace. Hang up now. Gotcha. Where are you, Angelo Tucci? There you are. Angelo Tucci. This guy's leading the prison transfer for my witness. Somebody's paying Tucci for the vigilante's identity. Somebody wants my name. Well, good luck with that. I'm uh, getting a little nervous here, Pierce. You find him? I'm tracking his GPS. Cut him off before he reaches the prison. Nice. Watch your back, he's around. No way he lost us that easily. Okay, that's it, he's gone. It's done. No more prison transfer. Now, I need to find a way inside that prison. A little face to face with my witness.
you still have contacts in the prison? I already asked if they could make our guys slip in the shower. They're dirty, but they're not that dirty. I'm gonna get arrested. Of course you are. Why the hell are you doing that? This witness we're after? He's a nobody. He was in the wrong place at the wrong time. He wasn't looking for me. I don't want to kill him. I just want him to understand I can reach him anywhere, anytime. That is a terrible plan. I love it. I'll find a map of the joint. Talk you through it once you're inside. Anything you need? My phone? Jesus, you have a problem. You need to unplug. Jordy, I need my phone. They'll confiscate it the second I'm in. Yeah, I know. I'm fucking with you. <laughs> I got just a guy. He's begging to settle his debt. Just get your phone. Lens over the last few years. You look kind of different today. I'm getting up. Palin Correctional Center. They recently upgraded the place with Bloom's state-of-the-art security. Network locks, automated surveillance. If they were holding the guy in an older prison, I'd have a problem. But Bloom's right on this one. They do make life easier through technology. Jordy, we're even now. Don't move. Pierce. Aiden. Smith! I already told you, man. You ain't never gonna find it until it's stuck between your shoulder blades. Yeah, yeah, get in there. I got 20 minutes of wreck time, motherfucker. Suck it up. Sign. Uh, obviously? Cut the shit. I should have sent you in here. This was your mistake. You might want to keep it down. You'll end up with a free trip to solitary. I can't get you out. I'm gonna find the inmate schedule. I'll be in touch.
on this new policy. They think they can nose us out of jobs with this automation shit? Keeley said his paycheck took a hit too. Blows, man. This totally blows. This guy had his own Picasso ink all over his face. Ugly as shit. It makes him an easy mark. He's up here somewhere. Quinn doesn't want to take any chances. Oh shit, man. How do I get in on that? Behave. Oh, bullshit. They was like blood, man. This ain't right. I don't buy that shit either. Somebody set up an execution. Who's that stupid though? I got a theory shot. Oh man. Hello. No, I didn't get you off the roof. Hey, who says I have to be moved? Who are you guys? What about my lawyer? Where are you? Where are we going? Answer me! Sucks. Show me the well, you paperwork! Shut up. Where's my lawyer? We're taking you to your no. lawyer. No way! Right after we clean you, you up do? first. I ain't going with a Shut bunch of crooked fuck up! Damn, better reach him fast before they kill him. That's a problem. Some guards just took our guy. Fuck, basement. They're in the basement. There's quite the little crooked operation being run out of this joint. Look at you bringing justice back to the prison system. Door's empty. Door's wide open. No silent alarms have gone off. Watch your back. What's a couple of bottom doing at the stadium? Doing a deal without cutting us in? Think we don't have friends in high places? They expect a cut, too. <gasps> no! I told you already. It wasn't a deal. You got called, man. Fuck that. Rick, stop lying. We warned you before. Think we won't leave you for dead too. Let them! We're making it hard now. Mm. Run a lot of fire. Do you really want to go home in. and buy a boat? Come on. Stop fighting my own cover. Man down! Man down! You're open! Stay down! I'm in trouble here! Shot fired! This is 
<laughs> Target sighted. Moving in. Relax. You're inside. How'd you get inside, man? You know, it was pretty simple. These high-tech security prisons, they make it quite easy, really. Have we met? What? Have we met? Uh, no. No, i never seen you, man. Mm. Yeah, I didn't think so. So you're in here for 60 days. In good behavior, you're out in 30. <clears throat> what does that say? Sixty years? What are you doing, man? I'm just showing you an alternate future. You know, in case you get the urge to share your stories or Make a deal with the cops. We're clear, right? All units possible prison escape. Be on the lookout for white male, Joe Smith. I need a unit up to the laundry. We've lost communication. Copy. We're on it. Jordy, it's done. Fantastic. I'm guessing you're eager to get out of there. There's a care package on its way for you. Where? Don't worry. You'll see it.
Copy that. A high-powered patrol unit is en route to the suspect. Damien bragged about a second hacker. Someone else inside the Merlot. I need to find out what Damien knows. had a very unpleasant meeting. Well, I didn't kill you. We used to get along. I taught you so much. Look at you, big time hacker now. Is that you in the news? The vigilante? You mentioned a second hacker at the Merlot job. But we already knew there was another hacker. You found something new. Ah, intriguing, isn't it? Come, let's meet and I'll explain. Tell me. Then I'll consider meeting. Oh no. My information, my rules. Besides, we need to make up for last time. I'm very excited. Come soon. You know what? Forget it. I don't need whatever you got. You brought me nothing but trouble. We're done talking. Oh, too late, Aiden. <laughs> you won't believe where I am. Never mind, I'll send you the feed. Find a TV and have a look. <coughs> That's Nikki's house. What are you doing? You should hurry, my boy. Your pretty sister needs you. Damien! You think you're a comedian? Damien, what are you doing?
played me. That son of a bitch played me and I let him. What's he doing, Nikki's? No, he won't hurt them. I'll kill him if he touches them. No, he has to know that. No, he's trying to draw me there. He wants me to work with him. Find the guys who attacked us? Fuck that. I need to take him down. Guys, I'm coming! Six years old. It's tragic. Where are they? Such a waste. All of this, it's such a waste. You know, the real tragedy here is that somebody like you was surrounded by so many fragile things. It makes you fragile. That's not how it works! You don't want to answer that. Yeah. Aiden! Nikki! Where are you? <laughs> Nikki! <laughs> ah. Stop and think. You fuck around and she is dead. <laughs> this isn't how I wanted it. But this is where we are. If you'd listen to me, things would be different. Just tell me where they are. Where they are? There's only Nikki. That little boy. I don't know where he is. Now this is what's gonna happen. That points to a hard drive. I told you there was another hacker. That will lead you to his computer. Get it? And you'll find out who ordered the hit on us. What do you really want? You lost your right to question me. I want that hard drive. That's all you need to know. And that's the price for Nikki. Stop overthinking, Aiden. I'll need regular updates. In exchange, you get to talk to Sis. Quit pro and all that. This won't end well for you. Perhaps, but don't get clever. I really have no problem killing that girl. We'll talk soon, partner. Where is Jax? Damien doesn't have him. I hope he's got his tablet. There. He's on the L. Oh shit, someone's after him. I can't risk Damien grabbing Jax. I need him safe. Come on. I can make it. I'll grab Jax and then... Nikki. Damn it. He's got Nikki. I can't reach him in time. All right, hack the train, get Jackson moving and away from these guys. Check every car. Kid's here somewhere. All right, that's bought me time. I can make the next station. Hold on, kiddo. Train's leaving! Shit! All right, get to the next station. Go! Go! Go!
off the road! Jax, you're safe now, all right? You're safe. Okay, listen, this is important. Back at the house, did you hear those men say anything? Come on, Jax, talk to me. All right, we're gonna find your mom. Dr. Mendez speaking? Yolanda, hi. This is Aiden Pierce, Nikki's brother. Is everything all right? It'd be great if we could meet in person. I'm on the train with Jax. All right. Uh, do you know where Nikki drops him off? Yeah, we'll meet you there. I need you to be brave for me, okay? Men at the house said this? This is good, Jax. It's good. Hey! Hello, sweetheart. What's going on, Mr. Pierce? Where's Nikki? Nah, it's been a rough week. She's forced herself to get rid of Lena's stuff, and uh, I think she's finally saying her goodbyes. How bad is it? It's bad. 
She should call me. Well, she wanted me to call you. See, we're wondering if you could look after Jax for a few days. We'll pay you, of course. Of course. I'll help in any way I can. That'd be great. Thank you. Nikki needs to grieve. I know it's hard, but it's a good thing. It's been rough. We're gonna work it out. Right? Hey, little man. We're gonna cause some trouble. Uh, let's go. See you soon. Get out! I'm heading into a tough neighborhood. I need to be prepared. Hey. What can I get you? Authorities at Chicago Correctional Center are triple-checking their security protocols today after a prison break. Facts are sketchy, but we do know that at least one prisoner managed to make it past all security checkpoints. Fortunately, Chicago's finest apprehended the prisoner shortly afterward. John Smith... All right. Racine's in Brandon docks, and I got no CTOS access there. Yeah, I better hack the district control center first. did that. so ugly, your mother had to feed you with a slingshot. <laughs> What's up around here? I see more- No! <gasps> not Come good, on, not speak. good!
This looks like Bloom surveillance. Are they actually monitoring private homes? All right, I'm in. Now, we seen. Let's find out what you know about Nikki. Someone here was hired by Damien. Start with the owner, Robert Racine. And just work your way down. 
Stay cool, just keep your head.
Nothing. The computer. We can hack the cameras through the computer. Nice to meet you. Are you double crossing me? I got you the Pierce woman. The woman, yes. I told you not to go for the kid. Did you think I'd actually pay you more? Now you've complicated things. Who's this guy after me? Did you send him? <laughs> I didn't send him. But I probably should have warned you about Aiden. You gotta help me, or I I'll tell him everything I know. That's exactly why you don't know anything. He's not gonna be happy when he finds that out. Fuck, man, what do I do? Whatever you can. Good luck. You son of a bitch. You're not getting away from me. Back up! <laughs> <laughs> Overzealous. Your nephew is not on my radar, but you go off the rails again. Put my sister on the phone. Listen to you. You think you have any control here? You get to talk to Nikki once you have something useful to give me. Follow that IP address and then we'll talk. Right now, you're just wasting my time.
Danny knows me too well. Knows exactly how I'll react. Must have been planning this for a while. That man always goes too far. He'll hurt Nikki if he doesn't get what he wants. All right. For now, I'll play his damn game. I'll follow his IP address. But I'm gonna find a way around him. There's gotta be a way through this. Damien's all ego. He needs this victory. I'll give it to him. I'll find that second hacker and you'll let Nikki go. Do I believe that? Doesn't matter. Right now, I got no other options. Son of a bitch. Fucking Marlot job. All right, Damien. Let's see if there's something you missed. Right there. Damn it. What the? Hey, it's me. You called me here. Shit. I have a lot on my mind. Yeah? Okay, come here. Take a look at this. Who is she? I don't know, and the file's corrupt. Do you have any ideas how to make the video play? This isn't fixable. You need the original. I'm running a search on your CTOS access. That's what I wanted to talk to you about. See, I don't think he knows about this. He would have bragged. I know him. Who would have bragged? She might be a lead. Or not. I just gotta stay a step ahead of him. Are you in trouble? An IP address. Yeah, he gave that to me. Can you find where that leads? What is all of this? Aiden, answer me. I'm not doing anything until... He took her, Clara. He, he, he's using my sister as collateral. Oh, my God. The man we traced? Yeah. Damien. Damien Brinks. Uh, I can't help you. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go. We'll talk later, right? After you're done. Shh, shh, shh. Cover your ears. your car. This way. Over there. Balcony. Fuck, man. There. An opening. Move in. Go. I'll come. Aiden. The motel sign. Give it up! Relax! We're here! Thanks for the advice! Hold the cover! Whoa, 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 help! Back up is here! Keep 
moving. Almost there. Too many of them. Clara, this way. I can block the road. Aiden! Wait! Go! Get in the car! I'll finish here! They're going to trap us! What are you doing? Just go! Okay? Of course I'm not okay. God, who are you? I don't know how to answer that. I know a place where we can talk. Here. A TV is reporting a fire at the Elmo Town. Can't just check out like everyone else? When have I ever done like everyone else? Are we bantering? It's been so long I'm tongue-tied. Saber it, because you're not going to see it again. Lost my network, I need some equipment. Not my concern. You didn't want to work as a team. This is your problem, you figure it out. But do it quick, I need your head in the game. Hey, sweetheart, your brother wants to talk. Aiden? Jack. Is my baby okay? He's safe. Where are you? I don't know. It's cold. I was blindfolded the whole way. I'm scared, Aiden. I know you are, and I'm getting you out. Look, I know Damien. He's not crazy. He won't hurt you. Just be careful around him. What do you mean you know him? He kidnapped me. He's trying to get to me through you. What? Time's up. My God, what did he say to her? The poor girl's in tears. Damien, put her back on. Do you want to continue this little chat? You follow that IP address and get me something I can use. Ta-ta. Alright, she's safe. For now. She's somewhere cold. Maybe outdoors. I'll keep her talking and maybe I can find where she is. lost everything. My hard drives, my network access. All right, I need to get back online. Where's Clara? Be careful, Aiden. Don't pull her into this. Here. Thanks. Those men, who are they? I don't know. Yeah, they must have picked up on the CTOS search. That's why I wanted to see you. DeadSec says that someone else has the system hacked. I took it, and I gave it to you. Oh, hold on. I didn't give it to anyone. I wouldn't. We need to trust each other. You know what? I don't have time to soothe you, Clara. If you don't trust me, there's nothing I can do. Someone shot up my motel room. 
My sister's gone, and I have nothing. You are not my priority right now. No, I know that. Of course. Do you know this place? Somewhere near here. It's supposed to be the first test site for CTOS. It is known as the Bunker. At least, that's how the urban legend goes. The Bunker? One with access to the entire city? Undetected access. I've done months of research on it. City planning, zoning documents, things they don't want us to see. There's a blank spot on every map. Right over there. Ish. And you've lost your damage deposit on a motel. It's fine. I need to find a way inside that bunker. Undetected access to the whole city. I could use a break right now. Somebody's been on that island recently. His name's Tobias Frewer. Tobias was one of the CTOS pioneers until Bloom fired him. The man is vraiment crazy. Or on drugs. Maybe both. He lives right near here. There's a homeless camp. He's homeless? He's got an underground shop hidden in there. Deadsec goes there for some of the more rare hardware. He can't forget him. He's paranoid and won't talk. I can be persuasive. I'll let you do the talking. You really want this place to be real, don't you? It is real. So you're buying into the legend. Papa used to take me camping in Mont Tremblant. He'd always say we were looking for treasure. I didn't understand then that he was stealing from the cabins. Gold watches, tools. The look on his face when it was something special. Like one time, I found an old rusted coin with a regal emperor. He said it was an ancient Roman coin, priceless. But he let me keep it. Said it was my door to a magic world, the whole Roman Empire. I guess I am a fighter's daughter. Stars in my eyes. Well, I hope this bunker's real too. It's real. A gang shootout erupted at the Owl Motel earlier, resulting in a gas main explosion. No reports on casualties. Police there. Are investigating. That's where Tobias runs his shop. Mostly black market junk. Sometimes you can find rare schematics, if you're lucky. He's not there. What now? Someone here knows how to reach him. I'm gonna have a look around. Fancy setup? at your shop. Well, it's closed. Wait, what do they look like? I don't know, man. Punk rock chick and a... Then it's closed. He's playing poker. I'll get them to deal me in. A poker game, huh? Let's see where you're hiding. There we go. Hold on, what? 
what's this? Someone else is tracking the call. It's got to be fixers. Oh, hey, you're not going to believe this. I finally got a lock on Frewer. I'm going to pick him up now. There they are. They'll hunt him down fast. I need to stop them. He's paranoid, but I found him. You want to go alone, don't you? All right. I'll meet you at the island. Legal poke around here. Who'd suspect? One of these guys is Tobias. Deal me in. Who are you? I don't know you. I, I, I don't know him. Relax. Are you Tobias? None of your business. I'll take that as a yes. N no, take it as none of your business. That's a nice attitude. Is that why Bloom fired you? Tobias! Stop! Damn it!
I'm not gonna hurt you! That ain't the truth! Oh my god! All right. I just need one thing, and then I can let you go. No, no way. They'll find out. I'm not one of them. Why should I trust you? Because I could shoot you and take it. Oh, that ain't an answer, man. All right. I don't work with whoever you think. No one needs to know about this conversation. No power to the bunker. They cut it. There's no power, do you get it? Might as well call that place a tomb. All right. I can deal with that. That's all it ever was when you think about it. A tomb. Anyone that ever touched that fucking place. We all have one foot in the grave, but I... I'm okay. I'm safe here. Mostly. Sure. The bias. May I have the bridge remote? Please? I built it, you know. The remote. Yeah. That's what I do, I build. That's great. Let me have it. Yeah. Fine. Sure. Well, yeah, you take it. Great. Yeah, it's your funeral. That's heavy, huh? <laughs> Trust me, man. It only gets heavier. Hey, listen. If you need anything, I mean whatever, you come see me. I build stuff. You do. I could easily end up a mess like Tobias. I'm being chased by the same people. Hell, I guess I'm homeless now, too. And he was high on medication or something. That guy has got to be careful. He's got fixers after him. If they find him, who knows what they'll do. Hey, by the way, Maurice volunteered a location. He seems... You'll find something there. He says if you want answers, you'll have to follow his trail. Whatever the hell that means. Might lead to something, though, right? It will. This is good. He wants me to understand why he did it. You need to reward him with something, okay? What, like a uh, cookie? I don't know. Get creative. faith in this legend and Tobias was pretty spooked by it I'm not interested in the myth and if it helps me get Nikki then I'll use it did you find Tobias I did and we played poker had a nice talk what did he say? Clara, it's real. I told you. Don't go in without me. I'm on my way. Don't worry. I still have to restore the power, and then we have to find an entrance. I'll see you soon.
Down, two to go. I just heard the generator kick on. It's gonna need more juice than this. Can you look for an entrance? How would Bloom hide a place like this? I hope there's a secret elevator. You pull a switch and the floor drops into a hidden base deep on the ground. Underwater? We're on an island. Wishful thinking. Up then. One of the buildings. I'll keep looking.
One more. Almost there. Once we're in, can you get us online? In my circle, this is the fine of the century. If I fuck it up, you can take away my hacker card. Tim, do you actually have a hacker card? Get us inside. Maybe I'll show it to you someday. I'm working on it. Generators are back there. I'll just hack the gate. Do it. I found it. I just heard the system come back online. Wait for me. Why? It's perfectly safe. Nobody's been inside for years. Because I want to see your face when the door opens. <laughs> Sweet home. Hmm. See? I was right. DeadSec would make good use of this. Clara, we need to make a deal here. No one can know about this. At least until after I'm done with it. Of course. Fingers crossed.
Kalis. Looks like Bloom took most of the hardware, but the connections are the important part. Voila. Can we be traced from here? This is a secure site. By design, it's untraceable, unhackable. Yet here we are about to hack it. I need to know where this IP address comes from. Let me see. What's special about it? It's just a lead, that's all. How did Damien find this? This is pretty well hidden. Doesn't leave any doors open. It looks like it's coming from the Rossi Freeman district. Mm -hmm. Viceroy territory. There. Surveillance. You can use those to get a peek inside. Can you connect from here? No. They're completely off the grid. This is bizarre. Well, if I can't connect from here, I'm gonna connect at the source. I'll have you up and running before you're back. She has a crazy
CDOS recording your every waking moment. <laughs> the public has no idea. Off my grid and in the dark. Rossi Fremont. They had such big hopes for this place. All that did was bring the gangs together under one roof. Loyalty to your neighborhood just became loyalty to your housing block. What about everybody else? They got in line or they got out. I'm gonna take a look around, try and figure out what they've been up to. Damien's IP points somewhere in there. These guys are running the place like a fortress. Never breaking alone. Okay. I'll tap into their network. And we can get a look inside. Anything you can spare. Anything? Those people are good, dog. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I ain't seen any of them construction workers come back. Yo! Who seen is that beep? Huh? What does it look like? The Viceroys have disabled the CTOS around Rossi Fremont. You gotta completely reroute it. It's not just the CTOS that's offline. This whole area. These people. It doesn't like the aftermath of a war zone. That explains why Bloom hasn't fixed it. Bloom has the money to deal with this. It doesn't add up.
Cause if I find you... doing yep we are connected you'll be able to peek into rossi freeman now thank you for all of this you really came through hey i can't resist a good adventure so i guess we're done no i'm just getting started i need to get in there find some answers and get my sister back and once you get your answers what then then i find out who did this and i make sure they answer for it Every single person involved in Lena's death. You still there? Yeah. I'm... I'm here. Okay, I'll see you soon. Device? 
How did you get this number? You were the You done then? You have what you need. So far, yeah. Okay, look, I, I, I understand if you're scared. I'm not scared. No one asked me to stay. Right, well, no one asked you to leave. You'll need to do better than that. <clears throat> I could use some help. I could use your help. Like a team? Sure, like a team. Not used to being a team. No, I'm not. Was that so hard? No. Let's go then. Sure. All right, let's dive in and see what we can find. You sure that IP is here? It's in here on the top floors. How do we get there? We ride the cameras. Where, where is he? Come on. Look at that. We got the whole place custom wired. These aren't typical game bangers. They're armed to the teeth. It's like a fortress. I don't see an easy way in. this before. I admit nothing. I'm the damn future.
We really lived here and died here. There. The IP address is coming from that room. There's a card reader on it. Shit. Key's hidden in his dog tag. Listen, ain't nobody stole from you, boy. Get your boss on the phone. Yeah, hey, it'll take a few. It'll fucking take a few. Hey, but get your ass in here. What are you doing with that? I thought I told you. I just thought that you... Like, this shit won't fly. You remember Grandma's poor dog? That ugly little fuck. Oh, fat head. <laughs> always came running when you hollered for him, right? <laughs> I always kept pissing on the floor, too. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. No, you, you don't. Listen, it costed me business. And who do you think's gonna win between you and business? Yeah, I, Mr. Quinn's on speaker. Business. Quinn. I put you in charge of merchandise and security. Now I find you still on my guest list. I won't be fleeced, Mr. Rank. Yo, chill. It ain't how it went down. See, I think you're confused. This is a business collaboration. Your guests are my guests. Listen, we'll talk this out at the auction. Don't I... be stoked, Mr. Rank. Where I grew up, we shot them between the eyes. Fucking leprechaun can suck my lucky charm. This fuck's a stoat. <laughs> Yo, it's, it's a weasel, man. <laughs> weasel!
anything else? I don't see how you could get on the compound. Never mind near that room. Even the security locks on the doors are encrypted. That fat kid, Bedbug, he's gonna go in for me. Just like that? And why should he help us? I'm betting he's one mistake away from a bullet to the head. So when he makes that mistake, I'll be recording. Nothing like blackmail to change someone's tune. How did you get this number? You are the vigilante. That's a dangerous accusation. Yeah, there's the vigilante voice. It scared the shit out of me the first time I heard it. Listen, I got something that might interest somebody like you. I found out the police are busy putting more guns on the streets. What are you talking about? I've been listening in. They're selling crates full of a man undercover. The question is, why? And, and where? And who? Tobias. Right, right. I'll show you where the sales went down, but you'll have to do the digging. Here's the deal, though. I want a nod in your manifesto. I don't have a manifesto. You will. This is getting complicated. If I can keep Damien focused on that hard drive, I can find Nikki. He'll slip up. I know Damien. I have to be patient. And right now, I need Bedbug. I read the news today. Something about a high-speed chase near Parker Square had all the hallmarks of Aiden Pierce. Are you with Nikki? Of course. We read it together and I highlighted all your signature moves. She was quite alarmed. She doesn't seem to know you like I do. Just get her on the phone. Now, now. The IP address. Yeah. There's something inside Rossi Fremont, some kind of small server hidden behind a locked door and an army of gangbangers. Now you understand why I need your help. Have you found a way in? I'm working on it. Let me talk to Nikki. Was that so painful? Aiden. Hey, we're getting close. You'll be home soon. What's going on? This guy talks like you two are friends. We're not friends. Not anymore. Nikki, just don't listen to his bullshit. You afraid he'll give up your secrets? I got no secrets. Seriously, Aiden? You expect me to believe that? I'm your sister. Well, shouldn't my sister be cutting me a little slack? Really? Oh, because I'm being held by your friend and you need a little slack. Well, it sounds worse when you say it like that. Aw, never hurt your feelings? I forget what a sensitive boy you are. You know me. Heart on my sleeve. Fun's over, kids. I hope your plan's a good one. Nikki does too. Careful. I'm taking a 
gamble with Bedbun, but I have a hunch he's my perfect target. He doesn't have much, has a lot to lose, easily intimidated, and ambitious, but lazy. All right, start with his home, tap his cell phone, just record everything he says. to the swamp meat. Now, what is it you have to do that's so involved? Work, Grandma. I got work. So, you got a job now. Well, why you didn't uh, tell me? It's not me? like that, Grandma. Oh, I see. It's not a job for Tyrone. It's a job for Bedbug. Uh, come, come on, Grandma. Bedbug doesn't even mean anything. Yeah, it does. It means I'm a player. A uh, what? A bed bug can get into any lady's bed. That's disgusting. No, I raised you better than that. Yeah, I'm on way. I, I gotta go, Grandma. Love you. Yeah, I love you too. Even though you're a damn Let's see what dirt I can dig up, dig up on you. If all goes well, I'll never see it coming. Good? Yeah, B, let's roll. Why's the rack doing all this? To control a village, you go in as a friend. Tell them that everybody outside their walls is some crazy fucker wants what they got. Eyes and ears in every house. 
You know what they're selling and you know what they're buying. You control them. Anybody step out of line, they gonna hand them to you. So you gonna put in a good word for me or what? <laughs> I don't know, man. Why should I? I wanna be a shot caller, dude. Come on. I'll try your ass wherever you wanna go. Always on time, too, B. Never let you down. Not even once, son. True. True, but... That's why I want to keep you where you are. <laughs> now, listen up, for real. Uh, yeah, you want to move up? I ain't supposed to say nothing, but I've right, been moving weight up in Parker Square. I talked to him. He might be able to cut you in. Damn, B, not so loud. Damn, man, they expecting trouble? Looks like I rack locking everything down. So what are we, babysitters? No, soldiers, fam. Remember when Fly and his crew disappeared? And yeah, they stepped out of line. Iraq put them down himself. I know, because I helped them bury the bodies. Man, don't say that shit out loud, son. You know your fan paranoid about that shit getting back to him? I'll say whatever I want. What? Are you paranoid, too? Only when I'm around your ass, fam. There. That's the blackmail I'm after. Rack hears this little gem and bedbug will be buried in a landfill. Thanks, man. You watch yourself. Always, Dobie. They gave it to us. It's our shit. We the police now. <laughs> you have the right to suck my dick. <laughs> Man, you nuts. You have the right to shut the fuck up, motherfucker. <laughs> Better stop whooping, cuz. Respect the law. <laughs> What's up? Got something you want to hear, bub. Trust me. So, tell me. I'm not here, fam. It's me. You got that dough on you? Always. Why? <laughs> no, this is this going to cost you. But it's worth it. Trust me. And yeah, we'll see about that. Yeah, I see that. Now you're supposed to be keeping a fucking 
an eye out. That's what you're supposed to be doing. Now you want me to call our rack and tell him you fools could have left somebody inside? Ain't nobody got past B. Got the whole crew out. This place is tight. Better be. Better be. I'm on 500 for what I know. Who the fuck you know that's worth that much cash? Because you ain't got much time unless you pay up now, fam. Oh, you, you gonna threaten me? You don't fuck with me, man. You think Iraq won't hear about this? Man, what's wrong with you? Oh, dude. Iraq? Serious? Iraq is your fucking problem. I, 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 I. I mean, man, tell me what you know. This better be good. Look, it's simple. They're going to call you down to the bricks, and then they're going to kill you. That's bullshit, man. Whoa, hey, hey, wh what are you doing, man? Come on, fam. Come on. Uh, what the fuck? Rev is stealing from my rack. You see that motherfucker? Shoot him. I'm out, V's. Do this right. guy who just saved your ass, and I can do a lot more if you cooperate. What are the bricks? Look, look, just get me out of here, man, and I'll tell you. All right, pay attention. <sighs> Ain't going out like this. Move. Move it. Got it. Man, fuck this. Grab it. Wait. Shit. Shit. You better hold that dog down. Yeah, it's all ready to roll. Now you get him to the brick factory, my boys will kill him quick. And I know he's a friend, so this is a test. You do what I ask, and you'll get a reward. Shit. Iraq's put a kill command on Bedbug. I need to show up in this place and deal with these guys. These foot soldiers don't mean anything to Iraq, but a weak link is no place in a gang. I've seen this happen to a few guys. They don't pull their weight and they get torn down hard. But if Bedbug can survive it, show he's got what it takes, Iraq won't just save face, he'll embrace the kid, show him off. Sweetheart Maurice was just moaning at me. Says you got it all wrong. He's a patsy. He was set up. Wine, wine, wah, wah, wah. Hey, do you mind if I drill a couple of rounds into his kneecaps? Yeah, I mind. You're so predictable. See if I do you a favor again. Actually. You need a favor. I'm setting up an ambush. I need you to bring me some explosives. Can you do that? I can do anything. Do I want to do it is the question. You... Oh, wait. Oh, wait, yes. Uh, you know what? This is great. Yeah, let me round up the boys and I'll meet you there. You mean?
Hey. Oh, what is that? Come around back and find out. <sighs> I told you. Let's bring in the boys. Ah, oh, Jesus. I thought you meant the explosives. Then I would have said I was bringing the girls. But I brought that too. No, I need some help. I was hoping you could involve these guys in a gangland shooting of some sort. I got a few loose ends I need to tie up and, you know, you do owe me those favors. I don't owe you anything. Now give me the explosive, something I can carry. Fine. These two nutsacks are some unfinished business from a Gabonese job. You should have seen the way that they tried to take me out. I am driving this beast of a muscle car right out of the 70s. You know when an automobile accident was still called a fucking car crash? Let's go. Yeah, so these geniuses here think they're gonna ram me off the road with some plastic eco-friendly shit bug. But it just makes this weird ping and bounces off into a park van. Here, hold that. Great. <clears throat> Thanks. This is what I have for you. It's a, uh, Sticky bomb. See? It sticks. Cool, huh? Hmm. So these two idiots are sitting in their car moaning and whining. They're all fucked up. I don't know whether to laugh at them or scream at them. Finally, I just pulled out my 45 and slammed a couple of rounds into their fat faces. So that's what I have. You deal with all this for me? No way. We could just do that. Do that. Yeah, it's like a like a practice round. What do you think, fellas? Practice round? Jordy. Okay. Love it. I don't need a practice round. No, just let me get a little clearer. Jordy. Fuck. Sienna Brick Factory. Rack's men were gonna kill Bedbug right here. I don't need the complications. All right. Just lay out an ambush, take these guys out. Word will get back to Iraq, Bedbug's rep goes up. And then he's mine. It's abandoned. They must keep security cameras running. Iraq's got the bees split into two groups. Uh, we're the ones out running this shit, and we only got two ways out. In a box, or under locks. Uh, there's fans up there on the top floor. got an escape plan. They're keeping all the money and the secrets. Nah. I don't give a fuck about what happens to any of us. I need to get in on that.
there. You didn't blow yourself up. <laughs> Not yet. Just trying to figure out where these guys meet so I can have some surprises waiting for them. Ooh, booby traps, fun. Tire tracks. Someone's regular parking spot. More tire tracks. And the cars come in from both ends. Still have time. They must do the deals right here. Just be ready. Bad Bug will be here soon, Doc. Man, Boss wants his own cousin, Pop? What the fuck you care? If Bed Bug stepped up, Iraq wouldn't pop him. Well, you tell Bed Bug. Maybe he'll step up on you. Then B's alive and your ass is dead. I'm just saying it's all. That fuck don't need to die. Put down my bitch ass fuck 
quiet, you! You good? We got this! Ah! Man, this some fucked up shit here, cuz! Why's up? We gotta flank this motherfucker! <laughs> you know we falling off out here! Nah, man, we gonna need hope, man! Friends can't come to the phone right now. They're dead. The fuck? Hey, who's still standing? Anybody? Come on, man. He's getting away. A report to Iraq. Bedbugs as good as dead.
Why'd you hang up on me? And what the fuck? Man, who are you? Just another player. I got a job for you. But it's not a job for Tyrone. It's a job for Bedbug. I'll be in touch. What is this? Oh, come on, man. Hey, somebody's after me. Look, they're, they're all dead. You, you, you gotta get me out of here. <laughs> you fucked in the head, man. I mean, listen to you. Seeing a ghost. No, 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 wait, wait. Shit. Yeah, what the fuck? What about Iraq? No, 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 stop it. No, don't worry about Iraq. Worry about me. No, it sounds like it. No. What you want? You're gonna be my eyes and ears inside Rossi Fremont. Oh, no! No, no, wait, man. Iraq will kill me. Yeah? What will he do when I send him everything I've got? You wanna see more? No! Just erase this shit, please! Well, you play along like a good little bug, and I will. I'll be in touch. Nope, it sounds like the club don't trust you. Why you keep calling me, man? You gonna get me killed? Tell me how to get close to Iraq. Uh, 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 you ain't getting close to Iraq, man. Uh, forget it. He never comes out. You want to rethink your answer? Uh, uh, wait, wait. Uh, the, the, the auction. Uh, he, he'll be at Quinn's auction. What kind of auction? Private. Yeah, uh, like like uh, not your normal kind of auction. Uh, invite only. So get me an invite. Uh, who do you think I am? All right. All right. I'll be in touch. Be ready. How did it go? Did you find a way into IREX building? Yeah, bedbugs on board and waiting for my call. Let's talk about the access card Iraq was wearing. That's our only way into his room. It's an RFID tag. We can clone it, but you need to get very close. Bedbug says Iraq's attending an auction. That's my chance. The auction, yes. Remember that briefcase Iraq had? Hard to forget. Crush the guy's skull with it. Right. He said it had the guest list inside. You can thank me now, because I've been tracking that case. Now let me check. That was quick thinking. If we get that briefcase, can you find me a name on the guest list? Name I can borrow. Exactly my thoughts. I'm sending the briefcase location now. I'll need to move carefully. If I can count on anything, Damien will be working in an angle. He's got another agenda. Okay, right now I need that briefcase. Now pretend this thing is full of solid fucking gold bricks. Do you see the 
a case? I do, it's moving. Wait, I can't believe it. What? Quinn's guys are pulling some old school gangster shit. A briefcase swap, really? Do those actually work? Never seen one of these. Why are they doing this? Did they fool CTOS? Anybody watching through a monitor would see every swap. They're trying to confuse the detection software. Interesting. I got the case on a boat heading up river. I got a bike here, I'm gonna follow. Maybe I can see where they're going. Give me a sec. What do you have nearby? <gasps> My guess, this will be a short trip. There's another drop for another pickup. Okay. Oh, no. No. Wait. There's an old marina, bought by Lucky Quinn in 1967. That's gotta be it. Says it's been closed to the public since the 80s.
What is that? Hello? Oh, fuck me! God, the fuck was that? <gasps> that ain't no junkie, man. Find me! Get away. What? I got nothing here. Moving on. Watch it! Chase him down. Check over there. My ears are whistling. Don't Nothing see here. Shit. Moving on. I've got Jack. I'll check over there. Nothing here. Moving on.
I'm sending the guest list from the case. Whatever this auction is, the club's not taking chances. Security will be tight. Okay, so we'll find you a suitable identity. Not a regular. Someone from out of the country. A guy they won't recognize. Okay. Okay. This one. Can you pull off a Mr. Pang? I don't think so. Any Europeans? Nicholas Crispin. 32 years old. Expat American. Hasn't been back in 12 years. That's the one. Oh my god. They list his preferences. This man is sick. And filthy rich, too. Will anyone miss him? What do you mean, miss him? Clara, if I'm stealing his identity, I can't have him around blowing my cover. I can't keep him alive. Oh. No, I guess not. My sister's missing, Clara. I'm gonna do whatever it takes to get her. Listen, if this is too much for you, you can walk away. I'll understand. No, I'm fine. Nobody's going to miss this dog. This is a good match. He's supposed to pick up his car at the dealership. All right, I'll meet him there. This auto shop's a mad mile. Yeah, I'm gonna need to hack the district control center first. The hell's going on? That doesn't look right. Wait a second. I think I see something. Shit, we have to do something. If you don't find him, I'll kill you.
I got nothing. I'll check over there. Oh! There he is! This wasn't part of the contract. Shit. Arm. Everyone get back. Get this guy. Oh! All right, that's got it. Now, Nicholas Crispin. Hi, this is Aiden, Jack's uncle. I want to make sure things are going okay there. She's still working things out. She just needs a little more time. Well, Jackson misses her terribly. She should at least give him a call. I can tell he's restless. He's not happy here. I understand. And I'll let her know. You have any problems with Jax, anything at all, if he wanders off or anything, you call me right away. I will. You take care of that sister of yours. Yeah. I am. Shit. Keep forgetting Claire's not used to this. I'm gonna scare her off if I'm not careful. Crispin's my ticket into the auction and my only shot at getting close to Iraq. He needs to disappear. Exotic and fast! <laughs> Mr. Quinn didn't know which color you'd like, so, um, you can take whichever.
It's that one, right? Get her ready for when I return. He must have a schedule or something on his phone. Can't let him get away. Heard stories about this. Fuck. Sick one. Quinn, the money? So why even associate with him? You ask me, he's just getting a foot in the door. Lucky's probably expanding. I'm not taking a bullet for him. That's for sure. I hear you. Keep him away from me. Shit. Shit, kid. We need more guys to wrap this up. You got it. We're taking hits here. Looks like Crispin was on his way to pick up something called the Poppy Special. It's at a club called Infinite 92. Infinite 92. No official listings. Icy mention of it in some thread here. Oh, looks like it's a gentleman's fetish club. Underground, of course. So the Poppy Special is a woman. That fits the profile Quinn had on Crispin. I doubt Poppy would have survived the meeting. What kind of auction is this? I think we both know the answer to that. I'm going to the club now. Crispin's invite is there. All right, here I am, all monstered up for the monster ball. Okay, just keep your hands, stay as little as possible. Crispin's as fucked up as they say, I'm gonna draw attention. Just find the auction invite and get out. The poppy special. Very good, Mr. Crispin. A signature dish prepared especially for you. We'll hang on to any weapons. Mr. Crispin, right this way, please. What happened to the guards assigned to you, sir? They couldn't keep up. Mr. Quinn wanted to ensure you're comfortable. On his behalf, we offer you a special gift. Please, enjoy as much as you like.
You're my special gift, eh? What's your name? Poppy? I know about you. What you do to girls. No, it's not. It's okay. I'm done. Mr. Crispin, is everything to your liking? You interrupt me again and you're next. I'm not gonna hurt you. Just come with me. I can help you. No. They'll find me. They said you were a monster. You're not Crispin, are you? My name is Pierce. This place is a success because of me. Get that into the retarded heads. It has nothing to do with any of the My gun. We hope you'll come back again. I need a favor. I gotta get Poppy out of this place. Call Infinite 92, pretend you're Crispin's assistant. Tell them I insist that Poppy be delivered to me at the auction. Yes, okay. She'll be there. I'll make sure of it. Maybe Crispin had to die, but at least we can save this girl. That's something, right? I'm not sure we can add things up so cleanly, but we're gonna get her out. Quinn's auction. Rack somewhere inside. Security's gonna be tight, and it won't be long before someone reports my mess at the car dealers. Just find a rack, scan his dog tags, make a clean getaway. <laughs> Sounds easy enough. Something tells me it's not gonna go down that way. Sorry, Mr. Crispin. We need your weapon. Wouldn't want to be rude. Not a scratch. Mr. Quinn said you like to see the raw merchandise. I'd like to know what I'm paying for. I asked for my merchandise to be delivered here. Where can I find Poppy? Mr. Quinn got your request. Don't worry. She's here. I have to tell you Mr. Quinn's rules, though. All payments must be made in cash or through a secured account. If you want to sample any of the girls before they're open to bidding, you got to pay a small fee. Premium girls are off limits. Don't want to lower the value if you get me. Yeah, I Make get sure you. it's a quiet night or we aren't going to be able to keep the other boys from shutting you down. Our clients are low-key. Yeah, yeah, why are the payment over?
This is Mr. Crispin. We're taking him to meet Mr. Quinn. They won't bring all the merchandise on stage at once. It's on my schedule for private show. Each one of them has been tagged with a number. It keeps things efficient. If you guests prefer to watch the model, I was told you want to see the stage. Well, how else can I get a full appreciation of what you guys do? Step aside. Mr. Quinn's waiting. Mr. Quinn is up there. Another bit received. Radio chatter's quiet so far. Keep an eye on this bit. Otherwise, it's clear. Do another pass. Yo, I just got word for the boss. Some of Quinn's guys got popped. Something ain't right. He wants Bits to double check. Open. All I did on everybody that comes in, triple check. Any other bids, gentlemen? Final call on this bid. All due respect, it's your man gonna miss it. The shit all risk now. Extra security ain't enough. We should have canceled. The risk is allowing yourself to be seen as weak. Relax. Do what you have to do. Don't make a circus of it. My men are stretched. Your men are expendable, Mr. O'Rank. Business must proceed. In the meantime, Find out who killed my man. That's all. Mr. Crisp. Would you excuse me? Of course. Our honor guest has arrived. Mr. Quinn, unfortunately, I can't stay. Enjoying our little pageant? Well, which one? The one down there, up here? Oh, my associate, Mr. Iraq. He's a loyal soldier, but he is young. What do you see when you look down there? Bidding has opened. Well, I see. We have an opening here. Someone flexing his power. Mr. Iraq sees it as an auction. He sees rewards. Experience has taught me not to be manipulated. On to the next item on your tablets. Not to back down. I don't detect an accent, Mr. Christman. We have an opening. Another bid received. Bids Life has taught open. me a great many things to get me where I am. Bid was raised. And luck had nothing to do with any of it. Mr. Crispin, they don't trust you. I know, we're leaving. Come here. Closer. A tattoo. It's a tracking device beneath the skin. It's also very efficient for business. I can scramble its signal. That's it? Yeah. Come with me. Okay. I'll send help. Myself. But the 
Try the back. New orders. I grabbed one to Mr. Crispin Fam. Do not let him leave the auction. You see him, you grab him. God, that shit aggravates you, Joe. out to kill me now. Motherfucker needs to be dropped once a-
Gotta find that bitch. Where the hell he go? Y'all covered. This fool from a mile away. No joke. Pick this motherfucker off from back here. Emergency. There's a big shootout going on at the Barrows and Brandon docks. All units, we have a report of shots fired at the Barrows and Brandon docks. Please respond. <gasps> Good. Cops will find those girls and get them someplace safe. As for those bidders, and he slipped past the bus, they'll end up on my plate eventually. them for what they've done here. 
and shut down this ring. Mr. Pierce? Jax has wandered off. I'm very worried. I was going to call the police, but I wanted to call you first. No, no, th that's good. He does this sometimes. He's stressed. He likes to ride the trains. Don't worry. I know how to find him. Please call me once you know anything. We really should involve the police if you can't find him. It's going to be fine. Really. I was worried Jax would do this. He's not a kid that sits still. He's got a lot of his uncle in him. Been searching for his mother. Where would he go? There he is. Jackson doing in here? It's that racing van. Damn it, he thinks his mother's here. This place is mob owned. After the auction mess, these guys will be on high security. Look for him and make it quick. Be careful!
Tell my wife. Tell my wife. Tell her I was fucking. <laughs> anything. Gonna move on. Huh? Be careful! Shh, 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 shh. What's that beeping noise? That's it. Watch yourself! Bombers, I'll check over there. Watch yourself! Go and get it. It needs to be dropped once and for all. Flush him out. Get you someplace safe. Come on, Jax. Come on. Let's go. Look on Jack's face. What did I do? I killed every one of them. 
What was I thinking? That's not who I am. Is it? There's so much I wish I could explain to you. Sorry about all this, Jax. I know it's not easy. Look, Jax. When I have to deal with these bad guys. I need you someplace safe. That's what makes me strong. I'm like the healer. Yeah, you're just like that. Except that's just a game. I'm warning you, if I don't hear from his mother soon, I will call the police. did believe it, right? Yeah, yeah, he did. I mean, he's all proud and shit. Look, I, I can't risk pissing him off again, man. You understand? There's a bar near Rossi Fremont. I'm leaving something in the trash. It's a wire. Go get it. Listen, uh, you spooked him at the auction. Now, nobody gets into the upper floors without his permission, including me. We'll be discreet. Come on, man. <sighs> Fuck. adventure. Keep an eye out in tardy heels and a short dress. Pretty sweet. You know what? was good. I shouldn't get upset about fucking meal man cost me a fortune. Some high end joint. Bedbug better come through. Putting a lot of faith in this kid. I don't know if he's up for the job. He's the cleanest way in right now. Let's hope I don't kill him. Gotta get inside that building and stay very close to Bedbug's signal. If we lose communication, that could panic the kid. We need to keep him calm. What's this guy's problem? Going 
Yo. Fuck is that? Close enough. Go. My finger's still on the play button if I think you're stalling me. If, if I get caught... He trusts you. You made sure of that. What's on Iraq's floor? Inside. You're going in today. No, no way. I can't. Listen. It's got some security door. You're covered. Just get your phone near it. You're going inside that room. I ain't no snitch. I don't talk to the cops. Good. I'm not a cop. I'm so scared, man. Just listen to what I say and move when I tell you. I'm gonna watch out for you. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Okay, now. Okay. Go, go. This is crazy. Move ahead. Yeah. Okay, move. Oh, fuck, bro. Fuck. Relax. How old are you? Uh, 19. Uh, I'm 19, man. Jesus. You're still a kid. Grandma says I was always big for my age. Go, go. I'm going. Stay low. Fuck, man. Fuck. It ain't worth it, man. Why are you hanging around with these assholes? And my family. Well, I, I thought they were. Do you got family? Yeah. 
kids? No. You? Probably. <laughs> oh, shit, man. Don't make me laugh. Yeah. That could be bad. I don't want to do this. Whatever shit. Ain't my shit to fix shit. Some other time. Who's out there? Huh? Mm. Better check this shit out. Fuck, man. Fuck. Move. Yeah. It ain't worth it, man. Find that fuck boy. Now, go. All right. Just get close enough. Only a rat can get in, man. Hold up a sec. I need to look through your camera. Computer's through there. So, why are you doing this, man? This, this ain't your world. It's complicated. We got plenty of time. Iraq was involved in something that hurt my family. I want answers. That ain't so complicated.
wasn't expecting this. I told you, man. I told you. Ain't nobody but our rat. Quiet. Computers through there. Fucking cold, man. Yeah, it's to cool the servers. Jesus, that's some serious hardware. There, get close. Shit. What? Just stay there. No, 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 no. Wait, that's not enough. Go back! Bad boy, what's this shit? I don't know, look, it ain't what it looked like. What it looked like to you, because it looked like a super-sized fucking betrayal to me. How the fuck you even get in no, here? No, hold on! No, I love you, man, you know that. <coughs> Who bought you, Quinn? No! Don't, don't wait, man! Don't you lie to me! No. Don't you fucking lie to my face! This how you repay me for taking you in! Come on, cuz, I look we family! You know it wasn't me! He, he, he made me do it! What the? What the fuck? He's real close! No! No, 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 don't drop me, Cuz! Don't drop me! Get down there! Find that bitch! Where the fuck is he? Where the fuck that bitch what just go? What just happened? He did everything right. In Iraq. Did he just murder his own cousin? I get him killed. I didn't get much data. No, I see him! Fuck, I'm going ramble.
Got something. It was only a partial download, but I definitely got something. It looks like his computer is full of blackmail on everybody. Just listen to these full of names. Police Chief Sex Tape, Bloom CEO Bribe, CTOS Breaches. Rack's sitting on the most dangerous weapon in the city. No wonder the cops stay away. He's probably had a chat with the police chief. Can you see what's inside the folders? Not yet. I'm trying. Is there a folder for the Merlot? Merlot. Yes, there is. Good. I'll be there soon. Hey. Hey, did this thing still work? Bedbug, you're alive. You need to get out of there. I am out. I, I, I just thought maybe I could help you get your answers. You know, uh, about your family? Uh, that video we saw on the screen. Iraq asked me about it. Uh, asked me what I knew about uh, Rose Washington. Rose Washington? I, I don't know who she is, but that's the girl in the video. Iraq says she's dead. Okay, thanks. That might help. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You and me? We done? We're done. You did good, Bedbug. He made a lot of noise at Rossi Fremont. Please give me good news. Iraq's got dirt on a lot of people. His computer's full of it. Everybody from politicians to CTOS execs. The Merlot is in there, too. I knew it. I told you it was there. It's encrypted. I don't have access to it, but that video we found at the Merlot? The woman's name is Rose Washington. Rose Washington. I know that name. Wasn't she with CTOS? Aiden, you've hit pay dirt. I followed your IP. Now give me my sister. But we're just starting. That video is important to someone. Important enough to attack me, to attack your niece. Careful, Damien. Come on, I know you want to follow this to the end as much as I do. That wasn't our deal. Oh, but it was. You said it's encrypted. Then your job's not done. No, you're not gonna do this. I can do whatever I want. Hey, it's me. Nikki, how you doing? I'm tired. They're taking care of me, I guess. Just come get me, please. Okay. There's other people with you. All right, that's fine. Just be ready for anything. Coming to get you. I need to see Jax. How's he doing? He's... He's a brave boy. He takes after his mother. But he's stubborn like his bullheaded uncle. <laughs> yeah, I guess he is. Doesn't take no for an answer. Time's up. Ta-ta. I should have expected this from Damien. It's working an angle. He wants something more. All right. One thing at a time. I'm gonna need the rest of Iraq's blackmail. Then I got leverage. And then I can deal with Damien. I didn't get much. The upload was cut off. Shit. I knew it. Okay. 
I have to find a way in myself. Are you crazy? <laughs> Even if you did get inside there, we can't read it. It's encrypted. Well, what am I supposed to do? Damien has Nikki. Just tell him he can keep her? Of course not. Of course. I'm not saying that. But he's playing you. Yeah, I'm not going to give him this before I know what it is. Damien cannot be trusted. I know that. All right, well, let's just... Let's just deal with one problem at a time. All right? If I can get this information, can you decrypt it? No, it's way beyond my skill. Then who then? Hey, what about that, uh... That crazy guy? Uh, Tobias, he used to work here. Okay, that's where we start then. Okay, but we need to be discreet. I know how to be discreet. Sorry. Okay. Okay. Wow. Wow. Raymond Kenny. It has to be him. He was a software engineer hired for the CTO startup. He created the encryption. The creator always have a backdoor. Wait, he can decrypt it? Kenny is crazy good. <laughs> I bet he built this room. <sighs> He's a genius. No, no, I mean a legend. I'm guessing legends aren't easy to find. He's way off the grid. No one's heard of him in over a year. Mm, he's lurking somewhere. Okay, everyone has a history online. We start there. We get Kenny's last known point and work backwards. He's been gone over a year. This could take a while. There. He's covered his tracks very well, but he's bounced through one location a few times. So we trace it back and we find his location? In theory, yes. You need to reach that point and connect me to the computer. I'll run a search from the bunker. And we'll have Kenny. Very dangerous man. Dangerous, huh? What's his story? He's a Bloom whistleblower or a cyber terrorist. Depends on who you ask. He delivered his message by blacking out most of New York State. I remember that. 2003. Not just New York, that was most of the Northeast. Killed a couple of people. He killed 11 people. They called it a software error. What the hell was his message? Kenny was trying to warn everyone. He didn't trust people inside Bloom. But I don't think he expected anyone to die. Now, he's in hiding. And we're about to find him. The place you're going is the very end point of Raymond's last signal. Hackers hide their locations by routing their packets through buttons. Yeah, it's a good trick. I've tried it myself. He's probably bounced his signal all across the globe. We'll have a problem if that signal ends in China or some faraway country. No, he's here. I don't care if he's gone off the grid. If this is Kenny's ex-Bloom, something tells me he wants to stay close to the action. Maybe. But if he really was in Chicago, why has he been so quiet? He's not the kind of guy to just sit back and watch. You said he killed those people. Must be a pretty price on his head. Good reason to stay underground. Aiden, we might have a problem. I'm picking up a lot of chatter about Rem and Kenny. That's strange timing. You said this guy's been dark for a year. I think we might have to alert someone when I find Raymond's signal. So we'll have company waiting for us. All right.
sending someone out. Keep alert. Whoa! Start looking. Watch it. Where the hell did he go? Huh? Search that way. Shit. Someone's on to us, Clara. Let's make this quick. What am I looking for? Connect me to the computer. I'll run a search from the bunker. Wow. Old school shit. No wonder good cops can't shut the club down. Clara, it's online. you could come up with, Ray. I better wipe the hard drive. I don't want anyone else tracking Kenny. Shit, he's taking off. Guy's got a lead on Kenny. Can't risk him running with it. Aiden, someone's hanging on. They can't find Kenny. You can't let them. I know, I'm on it. I'll shut them down. Hurry.
advised. We have reports of a high-speed chase through oncoming traffic. A large transport is involved. We need units on the scene. I got what I need. We're ready. You're actually going after Ray Kenny. I can't believe we found him. I haven't found him yet, but we're close. He might not even help, you know? If he decrypts those files, he's exposing himself. This guy was a whistleblower. You said those files had blackmail on Bloom. There was blackmail on everyone. I think an ex-Bloom radical would find that hard to resist. When you find Ray Kenny, what do you have to offer him? We've seen what happens when we dig. If he helps us decrypt those files, he's exposed. I'll find something. There's a reason he's hiding. Here. He turned against Bloom, exposed their abuse. I can work with that. You're going to threaten him? No. A whistleblower wants justice. He may be looking for a cause, and I can definitely give him one.
Hello, partner. I was just chatting with Nikki here. Saucy girl. You touch a hair, and I'll snap your neck. Don't surprise your siblings. She's a hothead like you. Why are you calling? She's wondering if you're coming to collect her. I said I'd check. I found someone who can decrypt the data. I'm all ears. His name's Raymond Kenny, an old CTOS developer. He's in Pawnee. I'm heading there now. Well, that is news. But I'm gonna use my veto here. What veto? He created the encryption. Raymond Kenny is also a whistleblower. He's gonna unlock all those juicy files and put them on the goddamn news. You know what secrets are when they hit the news? Worthless. I'm warning you. Find another way. There is no other way. You want this done, you need to get off my back and let me do it. Damien sounded worried. He's after the blackmail in those files. What's his game? What's he planning to do? All right, I can't let him distract me. Kenny's the answer. He'll help me decrypt everything. And he'll get Nikki safe. I'll need network access. I'll hack the Pawnee Control Center, then I'm good to go. Nothing here. Moving on. heading that way.
that's good. Now, where are you, Kenny? I got what I need. We're ready. You're actually going after Ray Kenny. I can't believe we found him. I haven't found him yet, but we're close. He might not even help, you know? If he decrypts those files, he's exposing himself. This guy was a whistleblower. You said those files had blackmail on Bloom. There was blackmail on everyone. I think an ex-Bloom radical would find that hard to resist. When you find Ray Kenny, what do you have to offer him? We've seen what happens when we dig. If he helps us decrypt those files, he's exposed. I'll find something. There's a reason he's hiding. Yeah. He turned against Bloom, exposed their abuse. I can work with that. You're going to threaten him? No. A whistleblower wants justice. He may be looking for a cause, and I can definitely give him one. Chatting with Nikki here. Saucy girl. You touch a hair, and I'll snap your neck. Don't surprise your siblings. She's a hothead like you. Why are you calling? She's wondering if you're coming to collect her. I said I'd check. I found someone who can decrypt the data. I'm all ears. His name's Raymond Kenny, an old CTOS developer. He's in Pawnee. I'm heading there now. Well, that is news. But I'm gonna use my veto here. What veto? He created the encryption. Raymond Kenny is also a whistleblower. He's going to unlock all those juicy files and put them on the goddamn news. You know what secrets are when they hit the news? Worthless. I'm warning you. Find another way. There is no other way. You want this done, you need to get off my back and let me do it. Damien sounded worried. He's after the blackmail in those files. What's his game? What's he planning to do? I can't let him distract me. Kenny's the answer. He'll help me decrypt everything. And I'll get Nikki safe. I wouldn't trust her. I wouldn't believe a single word that comes from her. Wait, hold on. Are you sure you're not letting her? Pawnee. Soda pop and apple pie. Yeah, but this small town charm is bullshit. Most of it's refugees from the city. Still hiding from something. I used to bring Jax and Lena here once in a while to fish. We never caught a single one. They never seemed to care. And yeah, some of my best memories are from here. And my worst. Ray's last known signal came from that marina. It's too easy to expect he's there. What is the start? No, go ahead. Whatever. You're like there. There can't be. Damn. That was sloppy, Pierce. Stay sharp. Alright. Someone around here received the reset code. Give me some space. 
What is this? Hey, mind taking a step back? Got it. Kenny bounced through a CTOS center. It looks like he's still in the game. That would explain why he chose Pawnee. He's sticking it to Bloom in their own backyard. Satellite dishes. This looks like an abandoned CTOS station. The power's still up. Kenny must have piggybacked off this.
man, where are you? I'm in the old CTOS center. Jed is the owner of Jedediah's Bar, Pawnee's number one watering hole. <laughs> Maybe the only one. I hope I catch the man sober. Uh, now that ain't... I was hoping you could help me. Looking for Ray Kenny? Never heard of him. Hope is a sad thing. What are you drinking? Pay the man. Hundred dollars. Cash. Damage deposit. Yeah. I'm not really a cash kind of guy. This is going on your tab. So. What do you know about Raymond Kenny? You aren't very social, are you? Don't want no trouble, T-Bone. Never mind him. He's all kinds of cranky. No appreciation for artists. Artists my arse. Moody drunk, more like. Drink. Listen, my friend, you stand out like my grandmother's bloomers on a clothesline. Don't worry about the flies. That there is protein. Come on, it'll put hair on your chest. City people are energy vampires. They'll drain you dry. <sighs> if you were followed, I'm gonna have to, like, shoot you. But lucky for you, my aim is kind of off at the moment. What'd you say that name was again? Raymond Cole. Pay for that, T-Bone! Yeah, yeah. <clears throat> <coughs> 
You owe the man a hundred dollars. Hello, Ray. I said, keep your voice down. Now that the introductions are out of the way. Listen to me, pal. I'm warning you. Your being here puts me on the goddamn map. I have some information. Well, ain't you special? The problem is... I can't decrypt it, so I came to the source. Shit. Then you have put me on the goddamn map. We've been careful. We? <laughs> Better give me a reason. Because that isn't making us the best of friends. Someone ordered a hit on me. Cost my niece her life. But whatever's in those files will lead me to them. I'm gonna find him with it without you. With you'd be a hell of a lot easier. Let's play make a deal. You think I'm in this dust bowl because of the, uh, ambiance? Ever since them bastards terminated me, I've been trying to find a way back in. All I need is someone to drop some spyware inside their network. If it were that easy, you would have done it a long time ago. Hey, if it was fucking hard, I would have done it a long time ago. It's impossible for me to even get at the perimeter without setting their damn alarms off. Place has my biometric profile. I got fillings in my head that sing to their security team direct. I can help you with that. But afterwards, you're gonna come with me to Chicago. Oh, am I now? <laughs> Follow me. Nice place. You got a real eye for art? That there is a booby trap. And if you can't recognize one, then you ain't paranoid enough, friend. I have quite a few. And well, if you found me, then it's only a matter of time before others will too. So let's get started. Listen, I'm running on a limited time here. The faster we can get this out of the way. I don't think you understand your own conundrum, my friend. Chicago is running on software designed to find people. Now, I know how the CTOS thinks, because I'm her deadbeat daddy. And she's still carrying my picture in her back pocket. Now, unless you can clear my biometrics from the system, I am useless to you in Chicago. And as far as my art, as you call it, if you fuck things up for me, I need to be ready for the fallout. Huh? Here. Let me show you. Ready? Heads up! Well, hello! You feel that ground shake? Whoa! That set my spine straight. Give it a go. Yeah. Ain't that something? Hey, if you blow your arm off, I'll sculpt you a new one. Your confidence is encouraging. Oh, I'm sorry. Am I here to boost your morale? Go, team, go. I think you misunderstand our relationship. 
I see an opportunity. You can help me, I can help you. I think you're missing the point. I found a sad drunk at Jed's bar, toasting his glory days in private. I'm not an opportunity. I'm your second chance. <laughs> well, hell. I think I like you. But it don't make us friends. First thing I'm gonna need is some of Bloom's hardware. I've been out of the loop for a while. I need to figure out how their scanners work. You want me to break into Bloom? Not yet. Somebody else already stole the hardware. Inside job. Well, that stuff's big on the black market. I've scouted these guys. Let's just say they're big fans of the Second Amendment. Take one of my rifles. You're gonna need it. Swing by the gas station for me, will you? I got the Pawnee militia holding what's mine. So I need you to go in and grab me my truck. I'm out in the middle of podunk nowhere making pals with a disgruntled cyber terrorist. Still, I need him on my side. Not just for the data. I use him against Damien if it comes down to that. I'll live up to my end of the deal. That's a lot of guys. You sure don't make it easy, T-Bone. I need a closer look. Target is trapped. He's not going anywhere.
you come here... Oh! No radio contact. Oh. Guys, let's send some men out and see what the hell's going on. We're on the scene. Run him off the road! Could this truck be any slower? Are you kidding? You actually got it? <laughs> yeah, I got it, but they're still on me. Ram the fucker! Oh, well, uh, what do we do now? Uh, What's that supposed to mean? I never expected you would actually get the damn truck. If you want the truck, you're gonna have to do better than that. Yeah, yeah. Okay, bring him up next to one of the sculptures. We'll have a little round of art appreciation. Ran him off the road! This guy likes to dip his hands in their blood and make a little art show. It's a fucking animal. Better hope he never runs into me. The bunker has been making noise. What kind of noise? It's online. Some people have noticed. Script kiddies, mostly. Nothing to worry about. I'll make sure they stay out. We've been probed a few times. Probed? <laughs> there is only one that worries me. His name is Default, and he's very good. I'll watch him. Let me know if he becomes a problem. All right, I left the truck for you. God damn, this plan might actually work. All right. Now, you're gonna need security clearance to get inside Bloom HQ. Have you ever chased a helicopter? And no, that is not a philosophical question. I've been chased by a few. What does that have to do with anything? Call it a hunch. We'll talk soon. Oh, no 
So now I need security clearance for Bloom HQ. Everywhere I turn, Bloom's involved. These guys are up to something that's a lot more than CTOS. I hope Tebow knows what he's doing. Okay, I'm in position. Now what about these helicopters? Wait for it. Go! Don't lose it! Do you have an end goal here? Yeah, I want to know where it goes. And that helps us because? Because it's a routine. Bloom HQ changes security protocol every day. That bird makes a trip over Pawnee with the new assignments. So basically, the chopper's gonna lead us to the security chief. And Bingo was her name. Oh. Covering over a trailer park. Well, that doesn't make any sense. Wait a minute, it makes perfect sense. A lot of the Pawnee militia run security for Bloom. And a lot of them live in that pit of paranoia. And one of them's the security chief. With full access. I can hardly wait. You remember that bunch protecting the truck? Same gang. The Pawnee militia is made up of preppers. Survivalists, anti-government types, my kind of people, which means they won't fuck around. Cold, dead hands, and all that crap. There. Got you. This is more than just a gun club. You got control of half the park. Is this normal for Pawnee? Ain't nothing normal in Pawnee. When Bloom started dumping money into this place, things took a turn for the weird.
Find it. Do you hear me? I don't see anything. We gotta move on. Huh? Looking street river. Keep alert. Brace yourself. Identify yourself. <laughs> Look, he's fucking with us. Right? Son of a bitch. Find him. Shit, you don't have him. Let's try another one. Access to Bloom HQ now. Damn. I'm sorry I doubted you. Why would you doubt me? I'm a realist. Listen, I'm coding a dirty little virus to erase me from their system. Damn, I'm good. And then I waltz into Bloom with my access and your code. What's security like? Oh, good point. You might call it thick. Yeah, well, let's thin their numbers then. You tracking any of their truck deliveries? Send me the roots and let me make some noise. Get Ooh. out. Pawnee militia is made of security contractors. That means when they fuck up, they lose business. If I create some fuck ups, they'll send more men. That means less of them at Bloom. Let's see this root T Bone send. And these guys are on a pretty direct path. Lots of opportunities for me. Watch it! Oh. 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 
got your back. He's around. Damn, we had him. Okay, Bloom doesn't know what hit him. We've got a window. Damn. I wish I'd known you years ago. The things we could have done. Don't worry. We'll do lots in Chicago. You got your virus ready for me? More or less. More or less? More. It'll work. I think. What does that mean? I'm walking into the lion's den. Don't be dramatic. You reach their servers, this thing will work. And you're the legend Claire has been raving about. The what? The who? Never mind. T-Bone's coming with me to Chicago. I had to breach the building. Bloom's head office. Security specialists. Yeah, it's not gonna be easy. And I'm a giant blip on their radar. But once I'm done here, I got Raymond Kenny in my back pocket. Entrance. Hey man, be careful. You can't just waltz in all how'd you do. The entire perimeter is monitored. They spot you and they'll put the servers in lockdown. That'll end things real fast. So don't get spotted. No problem. Out there. Search that way. Search that way! I don't see anything. Gonna move on. Look Whoa. out! Ah! Ah! Fuck! Oh, fucking hardware! Command, run a test on my... It's clear. I don't 
Gonna check somewhere else. Gonna move on. Looks clear. I'll head that way. This will work.
position. Shouldn't take me long. Once you've dropped the spyware in, it'll launch a virus. That'll scan the system for my data and wipe it all. And they won't detect the spyware? Nope. I'll be able to watch them, but <laughs> no more watching me. Miss Gardner, there's a Damien Brinks here to see you. Damien Brinks? What's this about? Said it's about Raymond. T Bone. I see. I've done it. Your Send name's wiped over. and the spy yeah. wears in. <sighs> yeah. I'm getting pings already. Good job. Now get out of there. In a sec. A name came up on the server. Someone I know is in the building. I'm gonna check it out. Don't screw around, Aiden. These guys ain't country yokels. I'll be there soon. all up. Why can't he see that? We need Ray Kenny. Gotta get him out of this. Nothing here. Moving on. There's nothing here. Nothing over here. Moving on. T-Bone said he'd stop me and he's actually trying. He won't win this one. You got trouble headed your way. Bloom knows where you are. I think you're confused, amigo, because I clearly remember sending you in there to erase me from Bloom's radar. Well, it worked, except the militia's coming for you. Some days I should just listen to the voice in my head that says, stay in bed. Some days, yeah. Jesus tapped out for Christ. All right, let's hurry the fuck up. Hmm. 
Start searching. He's Look out, gone. Start looking. Start looking for him. I don't see Jack. I don't see somewhere. Jack. Gonna check someone else. Huh? Need help. Wounded here. Oh, Jesus. Wait, that's no. Need better cover. This area is clear. I'm moving on. Taking hits here. I got nothing. I'll check over there. Oh. I got nothing. I'll check over there. So we're clear, I'm holding you responsible. That's fair. We need to get moving. Shit. Shit! I'm gonna have to blow the whole place up! Ugh. I need to arm some more traps. Then we're gonna have to lick and split. Damn shame. What the hell? Bombs in place, but it ain't ready. The detonator needs a few seconds to reach its charge. I need to make sure they can't deactivate them. You got earphones? What? Exactly. You need some appropriate music for the occasion, my man. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Clear. One place rigged, one more to go. Detonators only need a few seconds. If we want fireworks, we gotta hold one second. Can't let them move in yet, hold them off. Just about there.
shit, sniper! What in hell? These guys aren't messing around, Aiden! Jesus, hey! Get them guys! You got something better to do? Get them off of me! I'm allergic to dying, Aiden! Hey, I told you it was all gonna go to shit, man. <laughs> Woohoo! Here, you wanna do the honors? Wait a second, go, go, go. Hang on. For my portfolio. Go ahead. Hey, I'm sorry about the attack. Don't be. I try not to get attached to things anymore, because I'm used to losing them. Yeah, I need to learn that. I don't let go very well. Oh, I'm a Mount St. Helens right now, believe me. But that don't mean I'm not grateful. Despite that setback, I'm a free man now. I owe you. Now it's back to Chi-Town. So, you got a place for me to stay, man? Uh, we're... Squatting in your old CTOS station. Not the bunker. <laughs> well, that'll do it. I can't wait to pick apart these files of yours and see what's caused all this hullabaloo. That data can't leak, T-Bone. I'm trading it for my sister. You got nothing to worry about. You did me a solid. Now it's my turn. Feel that? That's the weight of trillions of bots of information at your fingertips. Well, you are gonna have to lay low here for a while. Uh huh. What's this all about? I don't know. She's somehow connected to an old job. Someone doesn't want me to find out why. I'm happy you're well. You want to tell me what happened? Corporate espionage, crooked cops, big explosions, honey. And you are? This is Clara. Clara, this is T-Bone, otherwise known as the legendary Raymond Kenny. Really? We can't all be pretty in this game, honey. No, I... I, I mean, I... Wow. I'm a fan. Oh. Enchanté. 
All right. What happened? Well, Damien was there. What? How did he know? I don't know. He's working on a deal of his own. Something with Bloom. You never told me that. Hang on. No, hang on nothing. You better tell me what you're messed up in, all of it, or I ain't decrypting jack shit. Now, Damien and Bloom. You don't need to worry about that. I'll decide what I need to worry about, Aiden. You listen to me. I want a name in that server. Now, our deal is I bring you the information, you decrypt it. <laughs> well, then you got a big problem. Hey, hey, hey. We need your expertise. The server is using your encryption. We need Raymond. Kenny. Are you sure you're gonna be able to get this data without getting caught? No. Yeah. Finally, some honesty. <sighs> well, you better get going then, man. Claire here can fill me in on a few things. <sighs> Thanks. Misfits, Clara's on my. Monitors, T Bones helping me breach Iraq's fortress, and Jordy. Well. Jordy does what Jordy does. It's time to see what Iraq's been protecting. Inside Rossi Fremont. I need your help. You don't pay me enough. I'm not entering that death trap. You don't have to. I need you behind a scope. Again? Ah, it's more reasonable. Hey, you won't guess where I am. You're absolutely right. I'm watering your plant. Maurice, put him on. <laughs> what? What? Who is this? <laughs> if you don't talk, you don't leave. Please. I got no name. You don't understand. I'm trapped. I can't stop. I can't stop seeing that little girl. She's just, she's just looking at me. Shut up. I said, shut up. All right, Weepy. Back to your corner. Jesus. Pierce, what did you say to him? You'll meet me there. Rossi Fremont. Of course. I'll be in place. No bed bug this time. I'm going in alone. Seen the layout? I know the room. Iraq's in there somewhere, and it won't take him long to realize I'm coming. He knows what I'm after now. This time I leave with everything. Rossi Fremont. Yeah, I see you. Are you gonna tell me why we're fucking with these guys? Do you care? Uh, not really. There's a computer inside that... No, 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 it's okay. I really don't care. I was just trying to make some small talk. This is up!
different approach to controlling the streets. Well, that's slightly terrifying. Use today, huh? Damn, they just keep coming. You sure you want to go in there? I don't want to go in there, but I have no choice. Is that your problem? You don't realize there's always a better deal out there. You get stuck in these little adventures that never end well for you. You done? For now. Clara, can you get this door open? We're working on it. T-Bone's got an idea. Yeah. They're running my encryption on the security doors. It's kind of hard to finagle remotely, but your Wonder Girl here, she just had a damn good idea. If you can cut power to that door, it's gonna default to the base code for about half a second. And you know the base code? Yep. I wrote the damn algorithm. Let's give it a whirl. But just a little... It's open. You can thank us in person. Be safe, Aiden. I think I didn't know you were coming. Jesus Christ, dude! Find him. That little shit can't be far. Oh shit! Sniper! Watch it, cuz! Chase him down like a fucking dog!
somewhere around here.
God, he was right there, dog. receiving everything now. I see it. It's all coming in. T-Bone's going to start decrypting it as soon as we have it all. That's a pretty big download. All of this is Iraq's leverage, his blackmail. He's been collecting this for a long time. There. That's everything. Hurry back, Aiden. T-Bone's decrypting it now. I'm on my way. Oh, man, look at you. <laughs> Crispin? No, no, wait. Pierce, right? This all you, Pierce? The auction? All right. You the shit raining down on me? Because I got a lot of shit raining down on me. <laughs> Stop right there. I'm not about to let you get away with this. You've been fucking me up, snooping in my shit, right? Interfering with my plans. Iraq, we're all dead. It was you. You were the other hacker in the Merlot. Yeah, that there is my currency. My masterpiece. And you're trying to take that from me. You took something far more valuable from me. I took from you. Motherfucker, I don't even know you. I want to be king in a tiny castle. Then you're wrong. And you're Lucky Quinn's lapdog. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Yeah. Yeah, I seen your type before, man. Self-righteous motherfuckers. I tried to encounter people off the battlefield. I'll take every file you have. All of your hard work, gone. The Merlot's a slick hotel. Bunch of rich white motherfuckers just waiting to pay up. So you take it from me? Officially, someone's gonna take it from you, too. The secrets get passed around. And all sorts of people are going to die for the secrets. That's the curse of power. Not us making a deal. 
You pick the fight, Pierce. Let's play it out. Yes, pussy. You should have come here. Iraq was protecting a tinderbox of blackmail. But he was after something bigger. He wanted the video from the Merlot job. He never did find it. Well, the Viceroys are gonna regroup, and a new leader will step up. And Bedbug? He's got a chance to get out now. I hope he takes that chance. I know what I'm doing. I don't need you on my shoulder. But I think you do. We've always been stronger as a team. If you know that, it's not weakness to admit it. Let's face it. Without me, you wouldn't have the data. And you have it, don't you? Yeah, all of it. I want Nikki. My god, I was right to bring you in. You see? We did it. Now bring it to me, directly. No one else. Let's do this. Hey, see this? Nice work. <laughs> There's so much, Aiden. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we just gotta sift through this stuff and find a name. Yeah, well, you're in luck. Because this mess has a shitload of names. And every one of them tied to some crooked deal. Dirty cops, the club, greedy moguls, even your stand-up do-gooders. Iraq was planning to blackmail the whole city. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's this? Is this off the server? Oh, hell! Somebody's trying to hack in! We'll lose everything! Shut him out! Now! What do we do? Follow that signal back. If we can find the source, we can kill his access. Hurry! Malware stray. I can't muck him out. I don't know who he is. If I had a guess. That looks like default. Yeah, he's a shady piece of shit hacker for hire. Very good. Disabling our protection program!
There. Who is he? That's him. Default. Son of a bitch. Who is it, Clara? He seems to know you. I don't know. I'm gonna hit play. It wasn't too difficult to find them. Two men. One's a hacker, the other a fixer, as far as I could tell. Never heard of them before. I can't explain. I, I, I wanted to tell you. Nice work. Names, please. Are you planning to hurt them? When has that ever bothered you? I trust the amount is satisfactory. Damien Brinks and Aiden Pierce. Aiden? Someone's knocking. Clara. Aiden, he's trying to delete our ship. We're gonna have to shut him out fast. Aiden, come on! Gird your loins, I'm killing the power! Aiden. Who was it? Who ordered it? If I knew, I'd tell you. I swear I would. I'm so sorry. Get away from me. <laughs> Shit. Can you trace it? Yeah. I'm on it. Son of a bitch. Come on, man. Come on! Ugh. Damn it! Where are you going? That smartass just hit us with one hell of a virus. He copied everything we had and wiped it from our systems. He knew exactly how to shut us down. I gotta go reboot the backup tower. Without it, no default. No default, no data. I'll go. No, 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 no. I'll go. I don't mind getting my hands dirty, man. You know what, Aiden? You're gonna have to stall Damien just a little while longer. I can handle Damien. I'll call you when I'm done. Good luck, amigo. Rat boy just made it personal. game he's playing, this default, he's putting Nikki's life at risk. He picked the wrong time to piss me off. Right now, I gotta stall Damien. Where are you? One minute you call me with promises, then nothing? Not a peep? This time, we're gonna meet. In person. How old-fashioned. Do you have something for me? We'll talk. off your gym membership. Fight the flag. Seriously, I don't have the data. Damien will know the second he sees me. Maybe I can make that work for me. He told Bloom he'd deliver what we found, including the blackmail Iraq has on them. Yeah, he's painted himself into a corner. You didn't bring my data, I didn't bring your sister. We're so predictable. You made a deal with Bloom. 
Where did you hear that? You have a problem, Damien. See, that deal hinges on the hard drive. What are you gonna tell them if I give you nothing? You're forgetting something. Your sister lives or dies in a phone call. Hmm. Then kill her. <laughs> you almost had me, Aiden. You're not thinking it through, Damien. That deal has sealed your fate. If you kill Nikki, you get nothing from me. You think Bloom is gonna give you a pass? They're gonna send fixers to hunt you down. So right now, I'm the one who decides your fate. Get my sister on the phone. We really are partners, Aiden. Like it or not, we need each other. Aiden? You okay? Are you all right? I'm scared. Please tell me that Jackson is safe. Yeah, he's okay. Look, Nikki, I'm... I know. Just please don't let them... You know something, Aiden? I'm tired of you not taking me seriously. Next time I see you, if you don't have my data, she's dead. from somewhere. There. WKZ van. We gotta shut it down. Hard, Aiden. Don't force me to show you up. You got nothing to show me. Wrong again. You know those fancy tricks you do with CTOS? I've been watching and learning. Want to see what I can do? This is what a deal with the devil gets me. <laughs> Catch you, my boy. That wouldn't be good for sis now, would it? Watch all units. Get your scan successful. Suspect located and marked. I'm moving away. Shit, bastard! Wait! Suspect has left the vehicle. Oh, he's over there now. Get yourself up! Hold it. 
Chugging in no time. I just talked to Nikki. Your sister? Is she doing okay? We're gonna get her back. I think I know how to find her. I heard a PA sound in our call way in the background. The voice said something, a name or a place. You think you can clean the audio? Try to make out what he's saying? Yeah, audio wizardry ain't my thing. Send me what you got. I'm sure I can do something. Okay, I'm heading back to the bunker. No, 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 no. We got one more job. You won't believe what I found. Default's love shack. Let's take back what he stole from us. We've got Default's location. Now, we'll take back what he stole. If he sells Iraq's blackmail on the open market, this has all been for nothing. Whether it disappears or it goes public, I have nothing left to offer Damien. Oh man, we hit pay dirt. Where are you? I got a webcam -y thing here. To find a line in and see what I found.
shit I ain't never seen. I'm in love. T-Bone, wrap it up. Some of the exits. He's in here. Yeah, I'm cranky. Forget the toys. We gotta get you out. Out of here quick. I'll call you when I'm clear. Don't get yourself killed. Oh, there's one more thing. When I was in that rat hole, I noticed that little shit's been fucking around inside CTOS. Yeah, he's got access. And my guess, your target numero uno. Chicago's heard of it. You will whoop the fucking do, man. Whatever it is, it seems to be default's local haunt. Is that all you got? Oh, and I found a six gig USB stick full of lesbian porn. You want that too? <sighs> Keep it. The Ambrose. 
Nikki and I used to catch a movie here, not just some dance club. Default must know we tripped his alarm. Yeah, he's probably expecting me. He's good. Look at that, he's hacked into the profiler system. He's toying with me. Go ahead, keep it up, kid.
Very clever. Faults in over his head. Okay, I've got him now. Just keep him in range and T-Bone will hack in.
got some kind of heavy-duty scrambler running. Don't be surprised if your shit stops working. Don't try and take him out. We can't risk losing the data. I'm oh. losing him. Lure him out. I'll track his signal. Don't wait. Grab whatever data you can when I get close enough. All right. You stay close. Just like that. I can worm into his files and he won't even know. You're too far. It's coming in. Well, shit. You seen what's in this data? I know some of it. What do you see? It's everyone. City officials, union reps. I got... I got phony contracts, payoffs. What in Christ? Sex logs. A lot of online blackmail. Wait a minute. We got CTOS here. You need to get closer. This kid, Iraq's been pretty busy. He's got some solid documents here. Looks like the CTUS execs use the network to rig their election. Get their boy Rushmore into office. A corrupt Chicago mayor. That's a surprise. I can't even tell how they rigged it. No voter fraud. They use some crazy code here. I don't know what I'm looking at. A lot of secrets here. Blackmail shit, it just keeps on coming. What exactly are we looking for here? A video. It's a woman. She's dead now, but something about that video was dangerous enough to attack me and my family. Tell me we got it all. As far as I can tell, it's whatever your nut job buddy might want. And that smiling woman, any video footage that fits? No, man. At least not that I can see. You sure it was on Iraq's server? But he was trying to steal it from someone. So who? I thought you want to know, I've never seen a contract with more zeros on it than yours. They want you bad, pal. That's nothing new. No, no. Trust me on this. This is something new. You've pissed in everybody's beer now. You need to leave Chicago while you can, because the fixers will catch up to you. It's only a matter of time. Thanks for the warning. Yeah, yeah. You're gonna ignore it, but I thought I'd try.
Hey, buddy. I got good news. I think I got a future as an audio wizard. You cleaned up the audio I sent. Have a listen. Brent Alston, the voice of the office, Brent Alston. Nikki's call came from the same place as that little public address. Brent Ulster. This is good. I'll run a search on his workplace. There. Nikki's there. I know it. Go get her back, brother. Found Nikki. Finally. Damien doesn't know. Okay, just move carefully. He'll have her guarded. I hope she's ready to move. Now watch yourself in there. It says here the joint's hired fixers for private security. They tend to shoot first, and ask questions never. Yeah, I'll hack in under the radar. They'll never know I was there. Nikki, it's me. Aiden! Oh, where are you? There's men everywhere. The, the guard here, he just... Uh, I don't know what happened. Listen, I know. I'm getting you out. I'm gonna stay on the phone, and I'm gonna walk you out. No! They'll find me. Nikki, there's a gun there. I want you to pick it up. Just in case. Oh, God. This is crazy. Aiden, I don't know guns. Ethan. I shot him. We gotta move. Listen to my voice. I think I killed him. Nikki, listen to me. We're gonna move now. I'm gonna guide you every step. Okay, move. Just make a run for that car. Get in and drive. Don't look back. All right. 
You're in the clear. But we need to get you and Jax out of town. Jackson's okay? Oh God, he said he, he said you were dead. He said he'd kill me. Where's Jax? I need to see him now. He's safe with Yolanda. It's over for Nikki, but not for you. Not to spoil the plans, but company's on the way. Chicago police just got a big tip on the vigilante. This all a game to you, Damien? Oh, sure. It's just a game. I'm in it for the yucks. You've disappointed me, Aiden. We were partners. You blame me for what? Ambition? I blame you for your greed. <laughs> uh, I need to go. Your hypocrisy is stifling. Drive safe, partner. The cops are hungry to catch you. I'm coming to pick you guys up. Get your stuff together. I'm trying to pack light. Only bring what you need. Okay. We'll be ready when you get there. to keep Nikki shielded from everything, and now... She's killed someone. Oh, damn, city's collapsing around us. I need to get her away, safe, before it's too late. Come on. Yolanda said she's gonna call the police on you. Get in the car, let's go. Tell me you were set up. Tell me! I found him. The man who hurt her. I know who it is. What? Nick, we're out of time. We need to go. Now! Yeah. Come on! No, they won't help us. But why? Because they're after me. Yeah, but we can explain. We can tell them about Damien. I'll tell them everything that happened. Nikki, listen. If we're caught, you don't say anything. Right now, I'm getting you two out of the city. You'll disappear and stay invisible. I'll take care of Damien. No, you're not making any sense. We don't have anything to hide, do we? It's you, isn't it? You're the vigilante. It's complicated. Where's this guy hiding? Do you see him? So, everything I saw on the news, the, the, the murders, May Stadium, that, that was you? Oh, God. And since I've been gone, what, what did you do to get me out? I did what I had to. Still no sign of suspect. We'll keep looking.
shop near here. A hundred and one flavors. Everything I know is in Chicago. It's my home. And now we just start again? I thought things would be different. I hoped. Things will be different. I promise you. No more promises, Aiden. Where are we going? I'm getting you and Jax away from here. And then what? We can move out of state and stay with... No, don't tell me. Don't tell anyone. It's over. For you guys. But not for you. It's okay, Jax. Didn't have to be this way, but what other options do we have? Are we okay? Remember when we were kids? And I would... follow you? And you'd try and get away from me, and... stupid me, I kept trying. I didn't like your cars, or... hockey. And your friends were gross. Yeah. I followed you because I idolized you. Like Jackson does. And I kept hoping that you walked me around, but... Eventually, I just hoped that you would look back. All I can say is I'm sorry. I'm not following you anymore. I know. <laughs> All right, sweetie. We're leaving now. Say goodbye to your uncle, Aiden. Are you coming with us? No. Your uncle's staying here. Bye, Jax. Headline, who you looking for? Are you ready for this? Probably not. Play it anyway. I want you to run an errand for me, Mr. Iraq. Right. Bit of name and address for this errand, Mr. Quinn. Brinks Pierce. 
Make it a strong morning. Get the family if you have to. Sir, yes, sir. What they do? Not your concern, Mr. Rack. Give us your talk. And I'll let you be in charge of the auction next year. He's one cold son of a bitch. Fucking Quinn. It was just supposed to be a fast job, a big payoff, no problem. Fucking mob boss. It ain't my place to tell you what to do, but in case you're wondering, Quinn's got some charity thing going on. At his hotel, the Merlot. Nikki will never come back. I've driven her from her home, from me. I know she's safe. They're both safe. Now Quinn. Lucky Quinn. He's brought all of this on us. He's the ghost I've been chasing. Well, now he'll answer to me. The Merlot Hotel. This is where it started. My whole world crushed because of this place. Because of Lucky Quinn. He ordered the attack on me. On my family. Well, he's gonna tell me why. And then he's gonna die. It's me. Where are you? We should meet. I've always made my money finding information for people. The harder it was to find, the more money I made. You didn't know what they do. I'm going to fix things. There's nothing to fix. I'm sorry, Aiden. Clara, what's going on? What are you gonna do? so long, I only recently just started calling him Lucky. Where, where was I? Not many know as well as I do how big Lucky's heart is. Generous to our city. And now with his charity, Stretching around the world, his generosity knows no bounds. I'd like to propose a toast. To, to Lucky Quinn! Mayor Rushmore, everyone! Thanks very much, Mayor. Enjoy your evening, everyone. Thank you for helping a great cause. My husband's contributed a large sum in the past to the cause. I'm sure we'll do it again this year. What my wife. Make sure she doesn't drink any more champagne. No, you're not listening to me. I want out. Hear me? I want out from this. Think I have time for more of your whining? Gang shootings? And that... that godforsaken auction fiasco? You've made both of us targets! You wanted to be mayor! Do your bloody job! You say what I told you to say. 
Your men took out a rack. A fine mare. Battling. Gang crime. Rose would be so proud. How dare you? Give me that damn video! You're out. When I say you're out. I gave your speech. Now please, leave my hotel. I have more important matters than you. You've ruined me. I'm not gonna stand for it anymore. Are you listening to me, Lucky? We've got an intrusion in the hotel security system. Someone check it out. He can't do that. Can he do that? He's got a gun. What I'm saying. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Yep. yep. Okay. Yeah. Well, I... huh. uh... Find some police safe. No, go ahead. Breathe. Whatever, man. Just breathe. Yeah. Jeez, yeah. silly body, Just isn't it? Don't let me get hurt. Shit. Oh 
Lord. I Shit. got nothing here. Moving on. <laughs> Get to cover. So awful. <laughs> Holy crap. Down. <laughs> oh my god. Where's that coming from? Head down. Oh shit. Watch oh. out. Start looking. I want to go home. No. Careful, he's doubled his men. I think he's expecting you. Good. You don't take warnings very well. You're a smart man. You should know when you're beaten. <laughs> that hit you ordered. My niece died in that car. Six-year-old girl. Oh. Is this what all the fuss is about? <clears throat> you must forgive me. You know, so many people come to me with the little problems. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's hard to keep track sometimes. <laughs> Get set up. I'm gonna rip you apart with my bare hands. Your bullets against my armor? Don't make me laugh. Where you are? <laughs> Sight again. Air support is fueled and inbound. Hold tight. Getting an angle. the target.
Young man, Mr. Pierce, just walk away. Live your life. I assure you, this room is impenetrable. So many people trying to catch you, including myself. You've been more elusive than we anticipated. when you go out there that the city will fall to its knees in gratitude? Everything all right? Your concern is charming. But I'd concentrate on your escape right now. I came here for you. You think bulletproof glass is going to stop me? Watching an old man die. Bigger men than you've tried to destroy me. I've ripped them apart. One by one. Expect me to bake? Lucky Quinn? On his knees. Beg all you want, that doesn't interest me. You don't even know why we attacked you. It was a mistake. We thought you wanted this. You were just sloppy, if you'd walked away. I would have forgotten you. What a lovely woman, Rose Washington. Wasn't for her death, where would I be? <laughs> Most women die without purpose. But she had enough sense to die in front of the camera. <laughs> See, and our mayor never tidy with his secrets. enough to fall in love. All of this. Lena's death. Because you didn't want to lose a puppet. Do you think you've won? See, when I die, they'll build a statue. You and you... You have to help me. The city Something didn't stop for your grieving family. Because you don't matter. I... I know. I have proof. Haven't you heard? I'm the vigilante. I clean up mess like you. I see. 
city. I can make any deal you want. You have to help me. Something's happening. I don't know what to do. Anyway. Don't lie to me, Rose. I, I know I have proof. Quinn's dead. This is the part where I'm supposed to say I feel empty, right? I'd be lying to myself. I finally feel awake, like I can breathe again. And Lena? Nothing can change her death. But maybe I can still do something that'll make a difference. T-Bone, it was Quinn after all. I'm uploading a video to you now. A video? Of what? You'll see. Squad to all units, air support is now inbound. Serious, leave her out of this. Did you forget? We're not partners anymore. All bets are off. What has she done? Not what she called Damien. Where are you? 
are you, Clara? Come on. I'm tracking a number of club cars heading your way. Damien, what did you do? Both of you feel very sad from the funeral. I could see how you made him feel safe. In our world, we hide in the dark, behind monitors. That's the only place we feel safe. It isn't enough to say that I didn't know. That lies would be lost or that it was only a job. I thought... If I could help you heal, help you find answers, maybe I could heal myself. But I can't. When this is all over, I hope we can at least talk. Or if not, at least I can't disappear. That's something I'm good at. I done. I brought this on, Clara. And all of this comes down to blackmail. Six-year-old girl dies because an old man wants to protect his secrets. You know Blue. 
can spin all they want to the press, but their hands are bloody. I'm done with secrets. She's dead. Oh, no. Oh, God damn it. I'm on my way back. It's time to end all this. You don't mind. I'm grabbing some of your stock. Figure that makes us even. Yeah, sure, of course. Take what you want. Fixes will be breathing down my neck soon. <sighs> I didn't even know Rose was dead. She should have just walked away. There's no evidence that Bloom arranged her death. Hell, Layden. You don't know that they didn't. You know, I've seen a lot of things that don't add up. City deals, voter rigging, all it takes is one good PR team to sweep that all away. After Rose died, they created that. Now, I don't know the hows and whys of it, but that code is dangerous. Something about... Well, I couldn't make much sense of it, but it was something about Bell or something. Bell with it? Hmm. That's what he wanted. You gotta burn that code, man. The rest of it, I don't care what you do with it. You know, Aiden, I'm, uh, I'm sorry about Clara. So am I. This whole thing is shit, no matter how you cut it. Careful, Aiden. When the lights go out, bad things tend to happen. executives are now being questioned run, that about a series of graphic sex videos leaked online. While the officers' faces not clearly visible in the cell phone's video, the police have not badge number is. Yeah, that term. Yeah, that term. Yeah, that term. Yeah, that term. Shocking footage has surfaced implicating Mayor Rushmore in the murder of a woman, Rose Washington. The woman was a former CTOS employee reported missing over a year ago. Mayor Rushmore has refused to comment, but a statement released by City Hall claims the footage is a fake, made by the hacker group DedSec in order to discredit the mayor. Come on, then. Come and get me! 
Let's finish this. Oh, but there's one thing I forgot to mention. You'll like this. I've unlocked CTOS. Completely. I am inside the system. And you are in for a show. <laughs> T-Bone? So there I am, waiting for my train when the lights go out. I guarantee you that's just the start of it. Damien has full access. Over my dead body? I'm not gonna let my CTOS baby get jumped up by that wackadoodle. There's a weak point he won't know about. Now get over there and shut it down. That'll end his joyride quick and pronto. I'll call you once I'm in. Nice to have you back. I do like being useful. <laughs> CTOS. It really is a wonder of human ingenuity. A model system making a model city for model citizens. I wonder what Bloom said about potential hacks to the system. Sound debate, I'm sure. Hackers? Oh, relax. Our CTOS is the most advanced blah 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 blah. Hubris, Aiden. It'll get you every time. But then you know that very well, don't you? the firewall. T-Bone might have an idea. He blocked us out. I need him disconnected fast. Well, shit. I got one idea, but last time I did it, people died. If we don't do it, people will die. What do you got? The whole network's tied to a satellite. Runs as kind of a safety valve to CTOS. I got a homemade virus. A real mean motherfucker. You gotta install it from three separate points. What does it do? It'll shut down your man. That's for damn sure. This could get ugly. You don't know the half of it, amigo. Call me when they're installed and we'll get it done right. Hey! really think you could stop me so easily? I'm disappointed. I took you for someone more clever, but I'm forced to see. You're like everyone else. Ah, the silent treatment. You'll leave me an emotional wreck. And who knows what I'll do in such a state. <laughs> Come on! Aiden! Impress me! What will you do now? Throw me off my game? Come on! You can do better. Damien's screwing with the navigation. He's trying to slow me down. 
Dante's energy consumption. The best offense is a genius defense. Done. Your viruses are in. All right. We're in it now. Do you head back to that weak point? Right where we started. Now it'll open up for you like a lady's... Uh, never mind. You'll have a clear line to the satellite, and that's what's important. Okay, clear line to the satellite. You say that's the safety valve? And a little more. Once you're inside, you pull the trigger. Lights out, Aiden. And if we're lucky, and I'm as clever as my CV says, you'll get a lock on Damien's location. That's all I want.
Why are you so damn stubborn? Quinn's dead. You got your sister back, and Clara? She stabbed you in the back. She helped kill your precious Lena. You know it's true. What about you? Some might blame you for Lena's death. I wonder who would think that, huh? But why stop there? Perhaps we should blame you. As I recall, the Murloc job was your plan. I blame myself every day for the plan, for meeting you, for not stopping you when I had the chance. I don't make that mistake anymore. I see a problem, I step in. Oh yes, the vigilante. I've read your headlines. You're the only problem I see now, and I'm coming for you. first decided to pool our talents, the schemes we were planning. <laughs> we had so much drive, but never like this. Look outside. We've taken down a goddamn city! Surprise, surprise. You got a speech, Damien? Anything you want to say? They know who I am now. That's it? That's all you got? Hey, fuck you! Look at you! You plowed over people to get to a mob boss. You think you're absolved because your cause is what? Noble? You played me. That's what this is about. I played you! Clara is as much your fault. So is your niece. That's why you sent your family away, right? They know what you are. You play a beautiful game, but sometimes you still lose. Blah, blah, blah. Jesus, you guys talk a lot. What are you doing here? Sorry, pal. New contract. Kick it over. What? Come on, kick it over. Oh, you're hilarious. You know, you guys take things far too personally. That's your problem. That's why this went wrong. There's lessons to be learned here, fellas. Up, 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 phone two. Give it to me. Come on, hand it over. I don't know what Damien wanted in those final moments. Death, I suppose. I thought I could fix a little girl's death, but instead it led to all of this. 
Exposed lies, corrupted kings, a broken city. And me, changed man. I don't look back anymore. I don't regret. I look forward. Everything is connected, and I'll use that to expose, to protect, and if necessary, to punish. Once again, Mayor Rushmore is dead. Police are not revealing any information. The leaked documents found extensive corruption and deep ties between the mayor and the Chicago South Club leader, Lucky Quinn. Did the mayor kill himself over this exposure, or was he executed? Bloom Director of Public Relations, Charlotte Gardner, has issued a statement regarding the recent CTOS troubles. We knew all along that our CTOS network would be a target for hackers of all strengths and skills. It's been an excellent proving ground to demonstrate how robust our system really is. We're so pleased with the results. Our firewall security withheld the worst of the attacks, and in some cases, trip switches closed the systems off before any access could be gained. Your personal information remains secure. Our CTOS network is restored to full operations. <laughs> where we want to spend more time with loved ones, be active in our communities, have safer, healthier homes and cities. Bloom Industries listen to you and your needs. We are embarking on a global journey. We want the world to be a community. CTOS 2.0, focusing on you, putting you on the global stage. CTOS 2.0, making smart cities even smarter. Up next, an interview with a woman who claims to know the vigilante, Aiden Pierce. Renowned child psychologist Yolanda Mendez is with us. Dr. Mendez, your story is extraordinary. You actually know Aiden Pierce, the man we know as the vigilante. Tell us how that came about. I met Mr. Pierce through the family, his sister. This was a surprise to us. We couldn't find any information about him at all. It's great that you've come forward. You were treating her son for trauma? Yes, well, naturally, I can't discuss any of that. Not even their names. No, 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 no. <laughs> we wouldn't ask you to. But that's how you met Aiden Pierce. What's he like? It's impossible to say for certain what he's really like. He masks his personality, and he's very good at it. Is he? He isn't like someone playing poker. This is a very smart man who is looking to gain the upper hand in every situation. And you're writing a book. Yes, I am. It's a book about the whole experience, a study on Mr. Pierce. I really wanted to explore this complex man's mind. I'm sure it'll be a fascinating read. Dr. Mendez, thank you. Dead sick has had enough. Our warnings have fallen on deaf ears. Our reputation has been attacked by people such as default. Heed our final warning. There will be a reckoning. We are vigilant against the Watchers. We are capable. We are unstoppable. We are at war. While a statement from the Commissioner's Office acknowledges the recent decline in criminal activity, the vigilante known as the Fox is only given the slightest praise for his crime-fighting efforts. An anonymous source told our reporters that members of the police department are more enthusiastic about the vigilante than they are allowed to publicly disclose. With Chicago still reeling from the shocking revelations of Rose Washington's murder and Mayor Rushmore's subsequent death, there has been little appetite for politics or elections. One name that's been floated about is Bloom's VP of Communications, Charlotte Gardner. Her supporters insist Ms. Gardner will restore integrity and trust to a city that sorely needs it. 
city officials are picking up the pieces from the shocking chaos brought on by a massive CTOS malfunction. The city experienced major power outages, bridge disruptions, and thousands of dollars in damages. While CTOS is back online, many are raising questions about the safety features needed to run a complex system in a major city. I'm bleeding here. You? I'm holding up. I got one last bone for you to chase. Maurice finally gave in, then suddenly he was all talk. I'll give you a location, the rest you can work out yourself. That's business, huh? Yeah, that's right. It's all business. Jordy's like that. Tidy fixer. Keeps the loose ends clean. Maurice is one of his loose ends. And he's ultimately my problem. He's the one who shot my car. Killed my niece. I want to say we're different, but I don't know anymore. How many people have I hurt? Killed? Who deserves to die? Who decides that? some loose ends. <laughs>
thanks to you, CTOS Network has had a successful year. With CTOS Chicago setting the standard, we are proud to announce an expansion into other major cities across the country and around the world. There's no better way to bring the city right to your doorstep. Look for CTOS 2.0 in the new year. CTOS.